Okay. I saw some um, white dots earlier. I wonder who's here. I have several horses. Main rotation, maybe. I swear there was people here. Question is where? Yeah, we have one. Oh shit, that's the safe. Ah, there's the second one. Oh shit. There. Oh shit. Already off to a bad start. Average show though. Usually average show has several people. Need to um make sure I am not rusted right now. Need to warm up a bit. I wonder if this is the uh, full average show party. Okay, no, one of them is average show so far. I'm assuming the Sage is probably grouped up with the Corsair though. I'm gonna go for him. Okay. Looks like the Striker killed the Sage actually. So I'm just gonna deal with the Striker. Oh wait, no. Never mind. Sage is there. Okay, risky. Wasn't sure if the striker might go for a grab. Good evening, Neil. How are you doing? A oh, Faru has fled, I didn't even see him. I saw um, at least one person from Average Joe. Usually Average Joe comes in uh, groups of five, but I don't know if that's going to be the case today. Oh, that's Dark Knight. $200 worth of groceries? It's like the cost of grocery for to feed an entire family. What was your theory of sort neutral again? Okay. Oh my god. What? He actually killed me before I could DPS down the Corsair, and I was fully protected. Do I even have pots running? I do, I do have pots running. What the fuck? How did he do so much damage? Are you framing faster? Well, that's kind of what Ninja does. I always thought Sork can do that because of uh, the stamina issues. Let me kill this guy first, probably. Oh, actually, succession DK. Okay, I think I'm safe here. Now we see the stage coming in. Okay, and he instant immediately. 
human damage crystals. I'm not, I'm only using. Oh, you think the sage is using human damage crystals? You're right. That could be it. But that's crazy though. Was only was only two forty nine DP bracket or two forty nine AP bracket. And 309 DP. That's a lot. Should be careful. Okay, he bees. I'm gonna go back to the main rotation. Well, Neil, I do think, um... Like, the... Playing classes tend to generally be better when you play faster. It's it's kind of like the theme of this game, I feel like. Like this is just the fast game, which is why movement debuffs feel so bad. Okay, stay just engaging. Let me grab him. Nope. I thought he can only Oh shit, okay. I thought after he dashes he couldn't dash right away. I miscalculated that. The main insight was that fast pace followed by slow pace. We are to constant medium pace. Yeah, I think like when it comes to videos, there's a heavy emphasis on fast mobility. And it, like all the classes that are SA trade, they always have slows. Wait, what? Okay, that was desync. That guy just had no HP. Yep. Guardians. Wizards. Stuff like that. Sages. I feel like that's pretty thematic. Okay. I got him. Now I want to deal with the Sage somehow. Okay. God damn it. I did the same shit again. Hello? Keep an eye out to see if the stage is here. Wait, what? Nice desync. Okay. 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 Is that really how it's going to be? Let's just take a full hit of Serpent Ascension and do zero damage. Because of desync. Good game, man. Great game. And then, of course, the striker gets rolled instantly. Okay, what is going on, bro? Uh, 
Uh, I'm gonna kill the striker. I think I can probably get the trick, get one here. And then try to turn. Nope. He respawned. But my grab, my grab didn't hit there. What? I would I try to grab for the iframe. But it just missed entirely? I don't get it. Actually, focus down the stage first. Never mind, kill him first. Keep Ziba. Actually, I can't get the stage here. Now try and. Okay. Is this res? I need to probably S3 straight down one of them. No, I don't think I can S3 down the Corsair. Okay, that's annoying. The Sage rest, and then the wizard, wizard came back before I could finish off the other guy. So using the rest strategy, you have to keep that in mind. But it just makes it like significantly more difficult because I have to kill everyone twice. Okay. Not much I could do there, I don't think. I think I just miss I just miss I just straight up mispositioned. You see? Okay, fine. Fine, we'll fight. Alright, I'll, 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 I'll just fight this striker every time. Fuck it. I usually don't like fighting people as they come back, go back, but... He asked for it. Here, PBs. Okay, wizard dies instantly. Sage beast right here. Okay. Oh my god. That's insane. I, my HP wasn't even that low. If this wasn't on seasonal, you'd be able to join. 
Yeah, but this, if this was non seasonal, I also wouldn't be able to play. My gear isn't really good enough for non seasonal these days. That's why I play on seasonal. We like, we have to like kill the sage. He just has so much damage. It's 309 DP and only 250 AP. And he's doing that much damage. Wait, did I? Wait, what? I thought I blocked jump to him. That's a misplay. So it's not even the it's not even the soft cap bracket when it comes to AP, but it's way higher than the soft cap bracket when it comes to DP. Like back when soft cap was uh 253, 294. But this is way more damage than that. I wonder if I have to like literally use booms to not just die. Yeah, I guess we go for the witch. I don't see the sage. Well, back when um we had soft cap, the uh, AP was two fifty three and the DP was two forty nine, and people took like two full combo start to finish in order to kill. But. He's just killing me while I'm doing Katana Shower. And technically this should be even more tanky. Than uh, like the actual soft cap. Well soft cap now, I'm talking about soft cap back then. Uh, there wasn't really a official definition of soft cap anyways. I just, I just mean like back in the days, is what I'm saying. Yeah, I know, that is Sage, but that's just crazy. Okay, I grab here. I ankle iframe. Ah, uh, he got away. Okay, kill him here. Wait, I don't kill him. Fuck. Uh, okay. The problem is, I wanted to... Ah, uh, shit. Okay. Thank you. 
I think I just fucked that up badly. I don't know what happened there. Over here as well. Okay, grab the Nova. QBs, okay. Probably have to be careful of these guys coming over. Yeah, I probably should have iframed out. in range. I thought that was offset by enough angle. Cannot be hit. Okay. Kill up a bit. Hmm. Okay. Teleport? Nope. The fuck? How was that the CC? I don't think I got hit by anything. Where's there here? Size. No, he's dead. Okay. Get the striker here. Okay. What? Except the dodge out of that one. Ended up SA trading. Hmm, I missed my grab. My mistake there. Okay. I'm gonna try and focus the Nova. Or not the Nova, the Sage. Fuck, Sage and Nova, they're basically the same class. <laughs> I don't know. I kind of, I keep getting them mixed up. Because they're not really classes. There's just like names. Or like it's not really professions, you know? Like you can say if someone's a warrior in real life, you can say someone's an archer in real life, you can't say someone's a nova in real life. Just a weird name. Okay. 
Get in here. Oh, fuck. Okay, too greedy. If it's damage I'm lacking? Uh, what do you mean, on seasonal? I'm not really lacking damage on seasonal. Or are you talking about my main character? Okay. Can I get in here? Oh, never mind, the striker got him. Okay, I fucking missed flashing light. I don't know why, but I have to be super close for flashing light to even land. Shit. Ah, the striker jumped in. A bad meme, what do you mean? I'm lacking damage. Are you talking about my seasonal or are you talking about my main character? I, f I failed the uh, Shadow Slump cancel right there. Fuck. I just sent it. Oh my god. The fuck? Where was he? Alright, I guess we're I guess we're doing this now. I I guess we're just killing everyone that spawned in. Because that's what we're doing now, so... Oh fuck, water. Can I jump? I can't. Why not just fight in the water, man? I have to V there to strike or grab me. Maybe too ambitious. I tried to just straight up kill the uh, Corsair. Or DK. Don't know why I called him a Corsair. Maybe because there was a Corsair earlier and they're gone now. Not sure where the Corsair went actually. Stages back. 
Okay. It's back again. See if maybe anyone went back to the main rotation, perhaps, by any chance. Well, we were busy fighting. So let's send them back to uh, the spawns, though. Have them join in the fight. Fuck you, Veed. Alright, anyone else? Okay, I'm going back. Oh, never mind. He's back. The sage as well. Okay. Grab him. Okay, he beast immediately. I guess I grab here. Hmm. See, the Corsair is back. But I don't think I can do anything about that. Okay. Of course there's vacuuming, that's not the threat. Okay, yeah, he's a scrap here, new beast, never mind. Okay. Huh, that usually works. Troll went different this time. Okay, let's go back to spawn. Guys, it's AFK, sure. Okay. Don't want to get caught in the choke point here. Nope. Oh, I caught him. Vacuum isn't the peel, so that works for me. Just have to get the Corsair fast before he comes back. But that might be difficult. Okay, well, two Corsairs now. Shit. And he's back. Alright. Uh, what do we do here? Let heal up. Oh. What? Oh my god. I thought I could CC him on spawn.
Okay, I guess, uh... This gun... Wait, what the fuck? Like, I actually couldn't kill him earlier when he had, like, 10% HP for some reason. And I had full HP. That was weird. Okay. Of course, there's here. Maybe just going for the SA tree. Oh, so just here. Man, that grab didn't work. Hmm. That's not a grab. Okay. Get out a bit. Be engaged. Okay, it looks like everyone got caught in the vacuum. Striker. Okay. Oh, looks like the striker's already dead. Alright, then let me just regain some health. Okay, I blocked jump out here. He's chasing. Oh, he beast. Okay. Coming back. Oh. What the fuck? How come I can never get people when they exit V? I thought that's supposed to be. I thought you're vulnerable when you exit V. Can I get in here? Oh, fuck. Okay, never mind. He runs into me. And now I get him here as well. And then he runs into me as well. Pretty sure I was at full HP before I died.
It's like you have to... So, so, okay. So, sages are ranged. But they do they do back attacks? Because usually ranged classes don't do back attacks, right? But I feel like sage has to be able to do back attacks. That would be the only explanation for why they do so much damage to me sometimes. Hey, CC the Corsair, but I want the Sage. Okay, I need to get out of the clone. Hey, grab here. Wait, or not? Did he desync? Looks like he desynced. Yeah, I, I think he desynced because I, I was doing full damage. Not in range for a grab there, okay. Miscalculation on my part. I thought I was in range for grab on the striker. Okay, I fucked up. I don't know why, I thought I had time to get the Sage before the Corsair comes out of his uh, animation lock. Okay, looks like the Witch is back, but they just get caught immediately, so that's fine. Can I grab here? I actually get the grab. That was kind of risky though, but it worked out, so we take those. Now... It was the stage? Hmm, nope. Okay. Nope. He says lucky grabs. We take those though. That was just a grab. That was just a regular grab. Okay, well, I'm getting my grabs today. That's pretty good. Is this, uh, what the hell is Ass Blast 5000? Isn't that the sword? Oh fuck. Okay, I have to iframe away here. It's casting blizzard. Okay, eliminate him so we don't get slowed. Ooh, this sage got the Corsair. But we still have to get him immediately. He's too dangerous to be left alive. Yep. 
Ah. I attacked into the mob. That wasn't supposed to happen. Okay. I guess he died to the Corsair this time. The Corsair and Sage is fighting each other. Oh, we get those last hits. Where did his teammate go, though? I swear, he had literally four teammates. Oh. This guy's easing. Oh, I have nothing. I have no resources. I needed to get pots. I have no, I have no resources. I see the sage up there, but what's he gonna do? Is he engaging? Holy fuck, I lost 3k HP instantly. It's a good thing he died to that SA trade. Like, what the fuck? So I don't know how the Corsair CC'd me there, really. came back. Don't know what that's about. Okay. Did everyone leave? I hope that's not the case. 18 people doing RBF right now. I hope they didn't all leave to do RBF. one person over here. Oh, wait. That's the sage. Wait, what are they doing over here and stuff helping their teammate? Everyone moved to uh, the main rotation, actually. So this is where the new fight is. Alright. gonna see what the Sork is gonna do. Okay, he's also coming over. Okay. Priority target is probably the Sage. Wait, how did that how did Murderous miss? 
Oh my god. I was supposed to get the second CC was the murderous there. Oh. He instant to me. Okay, I have to be careful to course there now. Shit. How many body counts? I don't know, man. But we are kind of fighting, like... It's really hard to say. Like, sometimes they... they I feel like they have between one to four people. Like, people who are just coming in and out. So... I'm not really sure how many people we're dealing with. Okay. So I think we have a ninja on their side as well now. Let me him real quick. Just decides to school AFK. See, I'm not sure. I feel like sometimes they just randomly go AFK. I'm not. I don't know how many people are like actually fighting. Man, how are you doing, Bwiz? Using one katana shower. Okay, where did they go now? So started your day having breakfast. Nice. Okay, so they were all at main rotation and now I guess they're all back at spawn. All right then. See, are they just AFK? Or what's going on? Okay, we have that stage attacking. They're not adjust so well in the PvP world. Oh, it just comes with practice, right? Okay, I have to watch out for when Sage like dash in the opposite direction. Lingering eye for super armor, I guess. I guess she's just wait here for people to come back from AFK.
Oh, it's too far away for me to block jump that. I'm surprised that worked. Good evening. Hello. Congrats on your new mic. Thank you. It's a twenty dollar mi Apple microphone that I uh, cap proofed. Did you get a headset too, or just well, a microphone? Well, it's, it's it's simply an Apple headset. Like it's one of the Apple earbuds. Oh, so it's a combination of headset and microphone. Yes. You prefer earbuds over uh, headsets. I do. I feel like it's less stuffy, and my sound doesn't suffer that much. I don't like the loss of quality. Huh. I always felt like earbuds hurt my ears. Well, that's because with your face, it has unusual proportions, you know? Um, no. So, that's kind of expected. I, I do not yeah. think that's the case. I, I, I think that's the case. Uh, so yeah, I wanted to say that all of these people I know from RBF, which is pretty interesting. Pretty interesting indeed, but I wonder if they all went to RBF. I think so. The real question is, are you going to go RBF? Because we're, we're just fighting this one stage now. Actually, I guess you can just go fight him. Yeah, that's what it seems I'll, like. I'll, I'll just watch. Because it looks like the other ninja at the other rotation is just grinding. Did he just use a pre awakened skill and got himself CC'd? So. Ah. Uh, but, uh, yes. I guess we can go RBF in like 20... Uh, what? Two minutes. There's like three people, uh, 20 people in there right now. Damn, couldn't steal the kill. Of course, yeah, I'm honestly, too fast for you. Okay. okay, honestly, I found that the strategy with Sage is that you just die trying to catch them, so it's better just to like kill them through SA. But they'll kill you through SA before you kill them through SA. No, because I have iframes and they don't. I have more iframes than they do, so I win automatically. Nah. It's already been discussed. That stage is, uh... over two. Basically Sork. Nah. They're, they're basically Sork, with, uh, no cooldown on Awakening. You already said Sage is overtuned. So they're overtuned over -tuned. now. Yes. It is unfortunate. But uh, this guy just instant here uh, Bon Katana Shower, so that seems to be fine. Bon Katana no. Shower is also overtuned. No Echo, right? Yeah, no Echo, because, uh, you know, when you okay. use a uh, headset, it eliminates it, the Echo problem. It, it's kind of like how you triple check a lock, even though you know I already got it, you know? I see. It's very satisfying. But I'm surprised oh. Apple sells $20 uh, equipment. I thought everything Apple sells is like in the range of hundreds. They're deprecated. They're not wireless and they're also not made to work with wireless or the uh, the special propriety outlet lightning thing. So you basically brought used headsets? That's... They're not used per se. It's more like they are not used by anyone. If you got, if you got my gist. Hmm. Hmm. So, well, you went back in time. I did, as a matter of fact. Headset. These, these used to be the all the rage in uh, 2015, but now they're back to like twenty dollar headset things, twenty dollar earbud things. All right. I guess at this point we're just waiting for the RBF because it looks like everyone went back to RBF instead of peeking at Poly Forest. We can go to the one. Er, yeah, two seconds left. We can go to the new one right now. Yeah, I guess we could. Everyone else seems to be grinding. How's my health not full? It's getting attacked by mobs. my camera setting zoomed in. I think I've set to 90%. Or 
Or was it 85? Wait, where is it? No, I don't. I have it set to 100, actually. That's weird. I don't know why I zoomed in. Alright, time to go into the new RBF. And uh, see how it goes. Also, my uh, my stream chat is lagging again. I need to fix. I need to fix that. Cause I'm seeing the message on like my preview window with uh, stream uh, elements before I see it. Overlay? Yeah, but uh, no, I'm seeing it on the overlay before I see it on stream chat, which is, so that's weird. Maybe I can refresh stream chat real quick. Let me see. Uh right, let me refresh. I'm sure maybe that should be good. Is that gonna ignore me? Just what is going on? What does this mean? What does what mean? Bro, why is this guy just ignoring me in RBF? Oh, it's because uh, in seasonal RBF, people tend to just stand around until the first person starts killing each other. So that's what you have to well, do. Well, I'm, 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 ki I'm killing him right now. Yeah, you have to initiate it, you know? It's kind of like a ritual. We'll just stand around until someone kills them all. Damn. It's, what team would you it's harder to kill people when their HP is low with auto attacks. What what team? I don't know. I am on the blue team. Dang, I guess we're on the same team. Can't hunt you down. You can always leave and come back. I know, but it's still only a 50-50 chance. No, you have it's to wait like for some you have to wait for someone else to join first and then you leave and come back. I know, but the timing on that is so hard. Pull out your weapon already, please, Corsair. Oh my god. See, even when he's being attacked, he's just memeing. That would be pretty hard to steal kills in this environment, since you're here. This guy is named I Play Musa. Well, if we have more Bro. people on our team, you can always go into the other team. Then you can steal kills just fine. Oh, well, he block jumps as well. Well, this is a free kill. The team duo exploiters, I guess. Are you Honestly, also the exploiter? I don't know. I have never met this guy. Well, he's the one who calls me exploiter consistently, so... I've never met this man in my life. He, he's uh, so good he's a rather salty exploiting. Man. Yeah, I mean... But if no one- if everyone's exploiting, then no one is. It's like The Incredibles. If everyone's super, no one can be. <laughs> Isn't that the case? Honestly, maybe they just don't know how to gear up on Seasonal. No, uh, we actually deciphered what he made me think was hacking, and it's because uh, I down smash him, and knockdowns last too long. He, he says ROFL, Sork isn't OP at all. I mean, he's not wrong. Ninjas don't have a uh, knockdown though, so... They do have knockdown, are you kidding me? No, they don't. People only use the knockdown when Serpent doesn't work, but Serpent always works. 
Famous last words. Trust me. It's a float, and a float has the highest probability of success in this game. Is it really float that has the highest probability? I mean, you could chunk grab, but grab these things so much. It's hard to say if grab really has a ass high of probability, whereas float... I don't know, I feel like float doesn't de sync nearly as much as grab. Yeah, I feel like floats are very consistent. As a sword. Oh, this this uh, wizard fucking. And also, like, now that we have a uh, corsair that can stack uh, grab resist, I don't think any class really stacks float resist. So when you look at it from that angle. It's pretty good CC. Say uh, traded to that by this wizard. Wait, you said the guy who uh, thinks you're exploiting is the uh, ninja, isn't he? Yeah, it's the ninja. So, like I said, ninja don't have knockdown. Otherwise, why would he think knockdown is OP? If he had it. You know what I mean? He does have it, though. Like, even yellow combos with it these days. I thought you said yellow is succession. Well, on the VODs that he See? posted from like a month ago. See, there you go. Yolo is the inferior ninja? Probably not. I mean, I didn't count the score, but I'm pretty sure he won more fights in our 1v1. This fucking... wizard is wall camping again. What the fuck? I didn't expect him to be right there. Oh shit. I collided with someone on the way out of a situation. This Kroger brand. Okay, well... That was just bad positioning on my part. I pretty much ran into that. God damn it. I think it would be worth killing the Sage. Because he has... Okay. Because he had, like, no points. I wonder if I can get the kill here. Oh, that was just desync. <laughs> so what the fuck? I really hate when that happens. Okay. I, like, get so I I, get I thought it was just two of them, but then three people rushed me instantly. It is it is fine. I need more points. Can you donate some? I don't have any points either. What do you mean? I don't have points. You have 28. You can give them to me. This guy is named iPlay Musa. Oh my god. Wait, why is the Nova called iPlay Musa? Probably because he plays Musa. He's clearly playing on Nova though. I have no frontal guard. Oh, that guy has 55 points. Come on. Damn, he's not dying because of RBF. And I should not have gotten CC there because I was in iframe. But okay. Oh, nice, we got a witch. Damn. 
RBF is so good already. Defense increase into desync through a ninja step. It's okay, I got pulled out of my ninja step as well. You don't have ninja step. Sure I do. It's it's literally every iframe I do that isn't forward. It has the same bug. <laughs> ninja step is supposed to be more reliable than silent charge. Oh but... my bad. I have I have the silent charge, because I also have to do shift direction key. But sometimes I get CC'd into, from a super armor, pull down ninja step, and then somehow there's a gap there. Even though, according to the game, there isn't. When you look at the uh, protection symbol. Oh my god, I just got grabbed in the back line. I really... I, I'm really... Being vacuumed here. I feel a strong sense of consternation whenever someone just dashes up and grabs me. Because that rarely happens in 1v1. It's just like so... Oh. I LOL, thought I... You know? I thought I got the uh, block jump. Fuck. This is a dangerous situation. This is a very dangerous situation. You get the kill here? I got one kill. Got the second kill, I heal here. Oh, no, never mind. My allies AO Eden. You have 117. Can you donate them to me? I probably will donate them to you because I just int, so. Just wait for someone to. Just wait for me to int and then kill the guy who kills me. See if I can pull that off. Couldn't find PK so back in RBF. We actually had some PvP. It was a good But then everyone, like, just went back into RBF instead of staying there to PK. I don't know. Oh my god, I just entered in violation. I feel like RBF isn't really as good of a game mode. So I personally would prefer that people do World PK instead, but... It looks like by popular demand, people are doing RBF instead. Okay, he didn't get stiff by the block jump. I thought I would get a stiff on block jump there. Something about rewarding passive play. Yeah, I think I told you about that. But maybe what I didn't tell you is that um, in RBF, when your HP is low, you just get a free defense buff for some reason. Like, the closer you are to dying, the more tanky you become. Which also makes no sense. That is tank? It's been a thing. Let's see if I can forcibly kill this. So it, like, so it makes it like your uh, damage judgment is just completely messed up. The storm, you might think your uh, attack does like 50% of their HP. But if they're at like 30%, they actually take less damage, and then that 30% might actually be more than what you need to, uh, what your skill can kill. And you actually end up inting instead of killing them. It's just really weird in general. It's yeah. actually well. I mean, it's actually not good for playing aggressive, though. It's better for playing passive, because if you because if you continue to play passive, then it will be harder to SA trade you, and if you and it makes it easier for you to like get up after you get CC'd. 
Whereas if you like go in solo and go full aggressive, you're get and you get CC'd in like a group of ten people, you're still dying either way. Yeah, that guy has the buff. Yeah, TA. See, I got him on with the stiff that time. I don't really know when I can get Noah with the stiff on block jump. Damn, guess I couldn't steal your kill. Maybe you need to focus less on trying to steal my kill. Steal and be more worried about it. me stealing your kill. are to be stolen. It's just the way RBF works. I gotta be here. A kill stolen is a kill secured. hundred points but I can't reach them because they're flying. Oh that's another interesting thing about RBF. Cause technically the people most likely to get kills are probably the uh, DPS classes. But ideally you actually want the tanks to get all the kills because then it's harder for them to die so they store the points. That happens actually so much. Whereas the DPS class getting the kill means that they'll give the points right back. Yeah, it happens a lot that like... Actually, no. It, it happens quite often that Novas, like Succession Novas, will end up with a kill for whatever reason. Because they actually deal a lot of damage with their pet. And then they're just unkillable, is the thing. Like Kivo, for instance. I told him to go Succession Nova. Okay, I thought I got the grab. Who is... I have no stamina. That was just an int. I should have smoke screen to block jump at least, but I don't know why I tried to like get out with uh, an unprotected skill. Wait, why does this guy have 300 points? He beast though. Okay, I get him real quick. Ninja has 300 points, and he's an easy kill. But like, everyone's too focused. But uh, everyone is too focused on the Succession Ninja, or the Succession... EK. Ah, uh, that was this bad play on my part. I, gr I was greeting too hard against the Corsair and didn't notice the people engaging me. It's, it's just annoys me, you know, when people don't die. Yes. Okay, and I don't know what slowed me like that. I couldn't do anything.
Okay. Beasting high frame. Ah, shit, I died. My third death. I think I B. No, I don't have B. I need to get like one last set of points so we don't lose. Maybe I'm just gonna int in the middle of their base. Let's try that. Alright, let's do a Z buff. Let's do... What? Oh my god. Okay, what the hell? I just oh, how did I get hard. hit there? I mean, they're not really guarding. This game is like, you don't really need to think. You just kill people when they come into you. It's not that complicated. 146. You don't need to overthink it, just don't die and go for easy kills. Alright, do you want to check Polly again? Or do you want to go back and... I'm going to the next RBF instance. Okay. Actually, I didn't notice he was a ranger. Crap? Nope. my buff just locked sometimes. I didn't even think people play Ranger on Seasonal. Since they are, kind of need high AP to really be good. I'm not really sure what's going on. Session Ranger? It's not even awakening. This guy has no defense. Did he just heal? Me and go step. Fucking <laughs> gore roll. No, we're just waiting for him to come out of spawn, I guess.
Okay. What do I do there? L literally, what do I do there? Ah, he has the buff. Oh. There's a uh, sage here now. Oh, it's an uh, awakening sage, actually. The fuck? I'm on the ground. Okay then. I wasn't sure that would actually work. Alright, it's the wizard with 50 million buffs. But he's on the ground already. Nope. Get out. Wait, I, I teleported to the wrong guy. I have many mages now. Okay. This guy is succession sage, isn't he? Yeah. Not sure what they're capable of. Uh, nothing. A lot. So their hits as they come out are either frontal guard or uh, super armor, and they all hit in front of them. So if you just get back attack on them when they get out, they die. Why do people play it then? Because they are very hard to track if you are, like, individually, because they have such long high frames. I feel like... So it's kind of like a school of fish, you know? You can't kill an individual one. How to heal here. I feel like when people play on low graphics, that's when they, um, don't see iframes. Whereas on uh, high graphics, I see I when people iframe too, just fine. Yep. But then, not everyone has good PC, so it's kind of a conundrum. I mean, you can still kind of track them. It's just harder. Yeah, but that's why people complain that iframe classes are OP, because they can't see them on low graphics. Okay, well... Can I steal this kill? Yes, I did. Thanks. And yes, I did watch your video assist. There is no kill steal. There is only securing the kill. I mean, when, in RBF... Like, wh whoever attacks first usually doesn't get the kill because of the defense buff. Because you waste your uh, highest DPS yeah, when they I don't actually, have the defense buff. Like, I actually will save the end of Grim Reaper just so I can get the last kill sometimes. If I'm, like, not being threatened and don't need a move. It's because of the uh, defense buff implementation. Got a Grim Reaper on it. Everything. I just like. I guess I should have just partially instead. Okay. Not sure who he was attacking. Looks like was just attacking. Fucking ice wall. It's just attacking mid air right there. I blocked him out of this. Ah fuck! I got meteored. Or did I? Not sure. You didn't get metered, you got catastrophed. No, I got stiffed. Oh, stiffed? Yep. Definitely meteor then. But I didn't get knocked down, so that's weird. Yeah, I guess it resists sometimes. I'm not running resist anymore. I'm running RBF. Full? Obviously not full, Ninja needs damage. Or it needs accuracy. They have Jin Viper. What about special evasion? Yeah, I'm still running special evasion. Like I said, I think there's a trade off. If you're losing more defense relative to the amount of attack you're gaining, it's probably not worth it. Because then you just get out SA traded. 
Yeah, I agree. But honestly, I'm still getting all that traded. Peeled, but uh, read anyways, it's kind of unfortunate. Oh, he's on top of the thing. Ah, uh, somehow I missed completely. That's just the pega. Ah, he escaped. God damn it. Okay, what? Oh my god, I got knocked down by something I don't even know. To uh, be out again. I need to pega RBF tonight, to be honest. I can't, uh... So, I have to remember, I can't use, like, slow blocks against Nova. Like the stationary block? Or, slow, like, a lingering block? Like, I can't... Like, I literally can't even transition stance. Because they can comment and just go through you? Is that the one you're talking about? Okay, why is this key? Got hat sash in right there. Holy clusterfuck. Whatever the hell that was. Oh, he has the buff. Fuck. I mean, there's a group behind you that's about to just... Okay, never mind. What do you mean? No, there, are... no, there isn't. I'm talking about the ninja on the staircase, or the wizard on the staircase. Well, you heard of Elf on the shelf, so get ready for wizard on the staircase. But that's why I'm yeah. not afraid. What? Can't believe I was off on the range on that grab right there. Is that fully super armor? That whole thing is super armor. Okay. What the hell? I really don't like it when people just randomly appear. I don't think I can appear. see anything here. Probably have to run away. It's really annoying. Maybe... Nope. Went for... Tried to get someone. Okay. Probably too risky. Yeah, it's gonna say trade it. Too risky. Bro, where's my kill? Oh, well. Recognizing the safe skills? Well, that's what I've been telling you. When it, when you're trying to learn this game, it's just a matter of muscle memory and practice. Sure, it may be overwhelming at first, but you just play the game and then you just start uh, knowing what to do. Can't block jump that, okay. You're pressing random buttons, but you're pressing buttons that you think do a certain thing. And that's how you get started. The way you get started on PvP in this game, it's uh... You press button was the intent to do some things. And either it is what you intended to do or it isn't. 
What was this question even? But the more, but the more times you press it. Oh my God. The more times you eventually press the right, right buttons. I mean, even on Perfect World, there's no way you knew exactly what to press the first day you played the game. So I don't think that's a really fair comparison. If you're talking about the game that you played for like years to a game that you're just starting to play right now. So I don't know about that one. Oh my god, I didn't have any iframes still. Doing really poorly in this RPF in terms of getting points, to be honest. Well, for what I mean is like, on Perfect World, you're not gonna know what the best skills to use are the day you start playing the game. It's like that with any game. You need time to get used to what the skills are. You need time to know what they do. Oh shit, I have no block actually. You think there's too many seals? Maybe. You need to start with the basics, video. You need to know how to stay but safe using the few skills possible. The thing is, a lot of skills on video is actually like very situational, or you just not don't use them outright. So it's so it may be bad. Like you may argue that's kind of bad design that they design skills that are just useless to begin with. And I can see that. Well, it's, it's more of an MMO sort of thing, you know? It's not a fighting game. You have to learn how to use skills in uh, unusual and unintended ways. Uh... Yes, but usually they give you... Oh, usually, like, in games, they give you skills that are useful. I mean, I think only 10% of my kit is, like, useless, though. Like, it's on a class the... by class basis. I mean, I would say ninja, you probably don't use half of your awakening skills. Oh. And like for sage, once you go awakening, you just don't use most of like all of your pre awakening at all. Same with Archer, you don't use like most of your pre-awakening. So yeah, like you, I, I guess you could argue that they should design things with new players in mind and not just like force people to lock a bunch of skills on day one, but... If you do figure out, like once you understand um, which skills you want and which skills you don't want, not, there's not as much skills. Like, there's probably only like one or three skills which does most of your damage early on. But it's just that you have to, like, I guess decide which ones those are. And that could be overwhelming. Oh my god. Dude, fuck wizard walls. Can Ninja jump onto a wizard and kill them? Nope. Regarding walls? Because, like, that guy's zoning is so annoying. So I just have to, like, whenever he's in the vicinity, I just have to watch out for, like, random meteors and fireballs. Which is, like, admittedly not a lot. But it's so annoying.
Like, I mean, I, they want this to be an action combat game and give elevation advantage, which is fine, I guess, but... Their skills are so scuffed in this game when it comes to elevation. So it's not really a good experience trying to deal with elevation in this game. Elevation is honestly so annoying. Okay. Once again, with the super armor into iframe CC. But sure. Keeping the Mexicans like Neo out? What? <laughs> what the fuck? Okay, I thought I blocked. Bad play on my part. Uh, and nice just get... Yeah, that was just bad. But... It's instantly dying super armor. What is this? Well, yeah, the thing with this game is that, like... Even though skills that should theoretically teleport should take elevation into account, it doesn't. Like archer skills, even though they're, you know, an archer, they don't deal with elevation. Like you have, uh, like probably rangers deal with elevation and like wizards deal with elevation well. I think that's about it, right? Okay, I couldn't move there for a second. I don't know what happened. I wasn't CC'd. That was weird. The real frustrating part is that you're vulnerable while climbing. Oh, that's what I'm saying. Like, in theory, they want the game to be based on elevation, but it's not really designed well. Okay, I do not know how I got CC there. I was behind the wall. Did this get stuck? No, he didn't. Yeah, got the quadruple kill, still didn't get the win. Like 33 points? It's whatever. Yeah. It's whatever. I generally don't do well in RBF, to be honest. 489 points. Fucking read. Back in or check poly? I mean, it's up to you. Or... I'm going back in. You don't have to do what I do. Uh, well, I mean, it's nice to discuss the same thing with you. I'll do a quick sweep check. If there's any PK going on, but I doubt it because I see all the people that we were PK in uh, RBF, so. How long do I have to check? Eight minutes. Yeah, like, I don't know. I feel like... Since RBF is kind of the game's official PvP content, people would just prefer to do it over, I guess, having to look in the open world. Yeah, I feel and, like and open wait for world people is so much interesting, though. 
Because, like, you have such, like, changing events, changing alliances, um, changing terrain, mobs. And I feel that makes it much more interesting than RBF. Because RBF is literally just as many people as you can pack into a small space and then just AoE until someone dies. So, Pro Abyss is really dropping the ball when it comes to, like, good PvP content in this game. Oh my god, I quit this game. I forgot the flag. Uh, and then what, you died? Yeah, I died. Oh, nothing wrong with that. I actually forgot the flag, I'm so annoyed. Well, it's not that you forgot the flag, you had to unflag to enter RBF. Yeah, so I, I forgot the reflag, so bad player is me. I'm gonna be PK because there's like five people outside that are killing each other, so I'm gonna have to stay out here. I guess, uh, should I go out now or do you finish this RBF first? Hmm. Uh, it's up to you. I guess it depends if they're together or not. Yeah, see, he did, he took he took no damage there. I thought he was just gonna die. What if I can just SA trade this guy to that? Oh, that was our wizard. Now we get the archer. Oh, and it's Black Pandas. He just runs into me? Okay. I'm not even sure what hit me was that. Ah, oh, fuck. Wait, are these two together? I thought that was out of range for the wizard, but that was clearly wrong. I think, I think the sage and the lawn are together. Sounds like you can't handle them just fine. them to attack each other but they both went for me at the same time even though it looked like they had been essaying at each other for a good while i feel like sage and lawn is like a really strong 2v2 combo though because of aoe and peel forcible peel yeah because because of their utility you've got one that's dominant in range one that's dominant in melee Well, it, you have you have both have range grabs, right? And then you have slow, you have damage SA trade, you have protect the CC, you have uh, range damage. Well, in essence, you have, it's just you have, two really you have, strong You have classes. NT block. It's just really two really strong classes. No, I think it's a good combination, not the class themselves being strong. What's the situation? Actually, see, today we had the Sage and Corsair, and it was much easier to deal with than the Sage and Lawn. Yo, 
Either that or Lawn is just a really good class. Well, but I don't know. Because I had the Lawn in course there, and that was pretty difficult for me to deal with as well. I think I just see new strategies versus Lawns. Because generally when I go up against Lawn, they just wait for me to attack and then grab me. And I need, I need like a new plan against that strategy. Because I'm just getting grabbed every time. Whenever I fight Lawns. What? Alright. No follow-up. Wait, what? He got out. How did he get out? I swear I grabbed him. Huh. He was CC, but my grab failed. Ah, that's just bad. Thought he was, since he was CC, I thought my grab would for sure work. What the hell is this? Bodily rejection. Alien expressing and protecting the error not applied. What? Wait, there's a debuff that makes you immune to PA? What kind of skill is that? Who, do, who even does this? This man has RBF crystals. Okay, I think I can get him here. Yep. And then... No, he teleports away. Okay, I grab... Nope. Resist grab again. Okay. We retreat. Okay. Oh, this is a guild of people. Okay, never mind. There's a guild? It's a card. Well, I count two people from the same guild. They're both kind of under-geared. Oh, never mind then. I'll let you know if there's an interesting fight, because right now I'm just, like, solving these people. Thank you. There, they all died. Oh, that DP debuff. That DP buff. Saved him right there. I have no block right now anyways. Oh wow. What if I get off from this? Nice. Oh, okay. Oops. Sage. Okay, maybe I should fight someone else other than Corsairs. Like this ninja for example. Because these courses are just iframing everything. I'm not making any progress. Maybe I should just stop trying to grab the witch. It's clearly not working. There's too many of them right now. Can't really go in. Oh, I get in here? Nah. I don't get the kill. Whatever. Okay. Should have been an iframe nice there. Tanky. This guy is actually so tanky. 
me get away. Recuperate. Shit. I thought that was in awakening form. But I didn't switch. So I ended up kicking him instead, and I missed the kill. Oh, he died instantly somehow. Can I say trade? I can't even say I can't say trade that. Wait, what? Oh, I didn't see him. Fuck. Ah, uh, thought the ninja might do something. Okay. Didn't see the witch. Okay, I need I need a better position. Okay. My grab fails again. Okay. I think I got double vacuumed. Cause I thought I was able to. Get, I thought I should have been able to get out, but I couldn't. Someone here? No, I can't. Fuck. How did they? Oh, I think I get up here. Yeah, people just don't die when was the uh DP buff. Hot summer classic outfit? Wait, where did you see that? Okay. I don't know how I was slowed. Which skill wait, which skill like slows? Corsair, which skill actually slows? All of uh the vacuum. The beginning of the vacuum. Wait, but, he, it's... But, he, but he didn't vacuum me. Or did he? There's a couple others. Vacuum has like a particular startup animation. Cause I got I got like slowed and I couldn't do anything. Like I couldn't even block. I, I feel like I've only gotten s slowed by the vacuum. But every hit though. I swear he didn't vacuum me. I just got grabbed by Sage. Never mind, he has no idea how to combo. Okay, I feel my grab. Oh, 
Or just let's go for floats. Floats definitely has the highest chance of success. He seat me there. I thought he was meteoring. It's, it's meteor, yeah. They charge a meteor, but it, they uh, it's not protected anymore. I'm pretty sure. Uh, they have two versions. One is a frontal, the other is not. Um, but the one with, er, no, that's wrong. One of them is protected, the other one's not. can see their names on uh with 720p well that's good at least that's you can that the uh, stream is clear enough for you to see their names and i just figured out how to kill kawaii pets he goes for the say he goes for the stiff behind every time I'll just instantly punish that since it's so slow People have so some uh, pretty meme names in this game, especially when it's seasonal. I mean, you have a pretty meme name yourself. Me? No, Anthony. Well, Anthony, yes. Oh, missed the kill on the striker. I'm talking about the name of your uh, family, of course. Not, not Salad Kingdom. But actually, Solid Kingdom is pretty meme as well, so... It's just the Kingdom of Salas. I mean, yes, those are some pretty good ones. Sounds like a name Chase would pick. I think Chase would pick a more cringe name than that. I mean, that's a meme name, but it's not like a cringe name. I don't know, maybe uh, ask Chase to name your uh, name a character. Two sixty seven. Better than last time, but still kind of meh. Cause they had someone with three hundred. Bro, I'm in super armor. What is this? Nani. But if I could tell you what name Chase would pick, then we wouldn't need Chase. Balsa Meadows.
Okay, yeah, Wayne, this has just turned into uh, me killing people. And then I'm standing in safe zone. Oh, wait, there's a. Now there's a team of. Oh, fuck. I guess this guy's name is Grabman by the Booba, and that other guy name. I wonder if they are um, together. I guess I invite you to party. Oh, that almost got me killed. Almost. Just, just kill him with that sage rate. Yeah, there we go. I feel like you're too good to be killed by a party invite. Yeah, I just press space. Violation is kind of cracked in terms of damage. I literally just hold two buttons and people die. Uh, where what where did the striker that killed me go? I think down here actually. Yeah, they're down here. I think I think their entire guild is here. Good, good. good. I'm surprised that I didn't see them as the entire guild though. Cause like. I killed them all separately. Maybe they're just not grouping up? Where, wait, where did they just go? I, I didn't look at the mini-map. Wait, fuck, where did they go? Did you see them? No, didn't he die? Uh, I thought he died. Okay, let's just keep- Cause you were hitting let's, him. Let's, let's just keep chasing him. Oh, here. East. This guy's on a horse! I want to kill everyone from No Touchy, I think. Bad positioning for the Katana Shower. This is bad positioning in general. I need more space. This guy's literally on a horse, Wayne. And uh, I'm also not using my pots. So that's also a problem. I'm not really worried He's about the right horse. Me. I mean, it's a meme, though. If it was Doom Horse, that would be a meme. Okay. Got both kills. Nice. Oh, it's the uh, it's the Corsair that was shit talking me a few days ago when I farmed him one v two. Okay, there's actually PK going on now. Versus uh, killed no touchy. Yes. I think that striker just rest. His skill is no touchy, but his name, but one of their members' name is Grabbin by the Booba. I feel like they need to be kicked, maybe, because clearly they're not going for uh, their name conflicts with their guild's ideal. Yeah, I agree. How can you promote no touching, but then have someone who grabs people by the Booba in your guild? He's in V. Okay. I wonder if I can just kill this sword. No, he just kills me instead. He's gonna try to down smash combo me in the middle of group PvP. Uh, but he actually summoned his um, thing to hit me. Yeah. I see a striker, guardian. Going for the Corsair this first. Corsair. Isolating. Did you get it? Okay, now two of them. Isolate the solo Got ones. Both of them? Players first. Got that one? Did he just res? I swear we just killed him. <laughs> There's Sunder Ace. 
I'll never say that again, Anthony. It's hideous. Oh my god, I'm gonna die here. I'm gonna beat. I'm super slowed, but I think I can kill him. Okay. I was very ambitious. Did you have to V? Nope. Okay, they're on you then. Okay, now this lock. Now I have me. to V. Now I die. I missed this... time when the uh, Corsair pops out. I died because I just didn't notice that I was getting flanked by the lawn. So that was really bad. Hmm. Um, but I mean, it's kind of forgivable because there's so many white dots, it's impossible to keep track of them all. You can't find a WTF emoji? Wait, do you even have a better Twitch TV and uh, Franker face installed? Because you're new to Twitch, so I'm assuming you probably don't. You're not going to get the emojis if you don't have those installed. Yeah, the emojis are part of uh, Franker Face and Better Twitch TV. You can install them as a Chrome add-on. Or whatever browser you're using. Uh, five on me? Two of them dead. I flanked the Sork. Nice. And then... I guess we're just dealing with the Striker now. They all V. Why do they have, like... All unli have like unlimited V's. Every single one of them bead. I have no HP left. I will leave. Goodbye. Spriker's the Saints just did like instant 2k damage or something like that. Okay. Sork is down now. Yes, did he escape? Down? No, he's down. Oh, looks, like, looks like he escaped. That sage just did all of my HP in one skill. Fucking lightning prison, man. Alright, spear. Let's see. Just just kill him, Thrasse. He slowed. A working ninja isn't really an SA trait class. That's fair. I guess that's my job. There's a horse. Wait, how did he knock me down, though? What? I'm gonna knock him off his horse next time he comes near me. Okay. Next dead. Sage is dead, and now we have to get... Mm, he... Afraid of the sword. But I missed the kill on the Guardian because of it. I think I'll go aggro on the sword. Okay. He's down? Oh my god. Ah. I knocked him off his horse. That's brilliant. Oh. So good. That's who you got. I BS. Ah, I BS or TBS. There was still a Corsair. I thought it was just the two striker. Did you die? Or did you be? Hello? Wait, what the fuck? Did I press Q by accident? I couldn't move. What the fuck? Oh my god. That was so bad. It wasn't even funny.
I really wish you can lock Q in Awakening. Okay. Good risky grab. We needed to get something done there. Okay, now you have to get out. Okay. The iframe again. How did he get the name? Um, the game, they reset the name a few months ago. So everyone has, so basically all of the old character name got deleted. Oh my god, had to be. So if you started playing earlier, then you could have gotten any name you wanted. This guy is uh, very mad at me. He says easy, and I believe that is dog shit. I don't have pots. Yeah, you could have gotten critical and destroyed the legacy. But also, I could have gotten critical if I was playing the game at the time, and I did not. I'm gonna do a quick repair as well. Uh, unlikely though, unless they deleted the character. Because they only deleted names that are, um, I think from like way early when the game like first released. Dude, this guy gets a step on me every time. So I don't think you could have gotten critical. Yeah, you know how like in a lot of games, people just like make a character day one and then they just quit and never play again? Like those are the ones that got deleted. But usually those are the good names, so... I don't think anyone actually does that. Sell use name on eBay. So I'm not gonna like officially recommend it to you, but I mean, I guess technically any you could do anything you want. Just get SA traded. Maybe I should have just iframe there. Uh... That's not my detail. I should have just thought, I should have just got out of that. <sighs> I'm really not Man, feeling the RBF crystals. I really wonder if I should just go Hooms. I feel like for you, you should go Hooms because you you tend to position yourself more aggressively where you take more damage. Whereas for me, I don't really take damage unless I'm going for kills. 
And my my uh, my skills are either instantaneous damage or instantaneous death for myself. So the you know it doesn't really matter. The thing is, I'm not really feeling I'm doing significantly more damage thanks to it was the army of crystal though. So I don't I don't really know what's going on. I mean, All Luck No Skill isn't really a unique name, though. I think there's already a lot of All Luck No Skills out there, to be fair. Holy, holy frame lag. There's a Sork somewhere. I definitely seen a few all luck no skills. I tried to get that name on like um Twitch, but then like there were several variations that was already taken. I mean to be fair, those probably aren't content creators like yourself. They're probably more like just random accounts. Yeah, but still it's not a unique name. Not a unique name for sure, but maybe a unique creator probably. Fucking infinite Corsair. Besides, I'm this using uh, Int Tuition right now anyways. Ah shit, I'm dead. No, I'm not. I held this green for, for too long. Actually, maybe I should change my family name to Int Tuition as well. Oh my god. Okay. There are way too many Corsairs right now. Well, the Corsairs are like tanks, essentially. I I mean, yeah, but they deal AoE damage in numbers, and like, the thing that kills me is, um, when I get traded while trying to DPS. Right. Because they can't really harm me until I try to DPS. But, if I can't DPS, I can't kill any. Maybe it's time to do, uh, I don't know. What do you think? Do what? How do you kill? How do you kill them when they zone by basically layering three AOEs on top of each other? Because there's three of them. That's the real question. I don't. I think you just don't kill in that situation. Uh. Okay. That would be. Leave. Okay, so you die. Unlucky. I don't know, I thought I didn't use murderers, but I already did for some reason. Okay. I have to be really cover. Wait! What? Now I died, not that. Why are there six of them? Explain. <laughs> need, need like, backup. Nah, okay. just, I got CC. Just play better. I wonder if I should use my Immortal Elixir. Because I'm not getting the damage I need. At this at this stage. Hmm. But the problem is, I don't know how to make you more like so under normal circumstances. Let's kill, kill this guy. He just rests. Like he's on the ground. Yeah, nice. So if I use my immortal elixirs now, I wouldn't be able to get them again. Oh, here they are. The rest of the group is here. What? 
Okay. Two kills. Three kills. Okay. Still. I have no frontal. I'm I'm trying. To... I don't know. I'm just not getting the kills I need. Same I need to, I need to like I need to like widow their numbers down, but they're not dying at the right times. Okay, and I missed my grab there. I don't know, I guess I popped the I guess I popped the elixirs. No time like the present. I'm just gonna use the rain. Okay. I don't know how I oh, died wow. there. Wait, I, how did I even die there? I have no idea. You resisted TBS. Uh, okay, fuck it. Okay, so that's just the choke point. You can't really fight in the choke point. But... We kind of like to staff do, so... I just have to play more defensive, I think, at this point. Same. What? See, I CC an iframe. I don't know what to say about that one. Man, if this Sage AoEs them now... With this uh, bonus damage to a grouped up target, he's gonna get the huge kills, I think. Okay, I can't even cast Katana Shower right now, what the heck? Like, holy fuck. Okay. Okay. I need to really think this through. I'm just, I'm very separated from you. Because I just respawned in the wrong location. Okay, iframe here. How far away did you spawn? At the other spawn point. Not not the polyforest one. Oh, you didn't even spawn in polyforest? How's that possible? No, I did, but Okay. I think I let the sage go in. We can do the dirty work. Okay, more are coming. I two of them. Ah, I couldn't get out. Fuck. The problem is, ah, uh, with the block meter drain, they just CC me through my block.
Are you just soloing right now? Yeah. Okay. What did V? I guess we could invite the sage since he's uh, molding. Do I get? No, I don't get it. Okay, I get one at least. Fuck. Couldn't really get away. Okay. Maybe I tried to invite this guy. Never mind, he's not joining, it looks like. Oh, he did join, actually. Like with the sage here, he was just he was just do wonders with the AOE boost, damage boost to uh, group the targets. What? Are you fucking kidding me? Oops. Okay, that was too ambitious. I should have uh, dodged a bit more. Oh my god, I just lost 1v1 versus a striker. How is... Such a humiliation, this fan would say. That's embarrassing, as BDO players would say. It is embarrassing, actually. What is this group? Can someone explain the situation to me? What do you mean? The situation has been the same the, this entire time. Are they just all chasing you? Yeah, everyone is in the same uh, party. They're all, they're all together. We fight all of them. Very well. And we have the Sage, so we need to like... I don't know. Hope he gets some good AoEs. Because he should, he, he should do like extra extra damage against this. Like they get they get damage buffs up to like 10 people, right? Oh my god. How are there so many of them? Ah, uh, it was too slow to do anything. I guess we should coordinate response. Because we just need one good wipe to get a situation. Ah, uh, fuck. Sage just instantly died. Yeah, our sage is kind of uh, getting wrecked. Oh my god. Uh. 
Oh, fuck. They came back fast. Or we can, like, try and split them. I don't know. It's either we group them and hope the stage can do something, or we try and split them. Stage is not going to do anything. Yeah, maybe, maybe, maybe we try and split them. The stage is Pepega. He's not going to... He's not going to... Do anything for us. Oh, I'm not doing any, uh, enough damage with my pre awaken skills because I don't have to, because I'm not at the next bracket on pre awaken. Which is a huge issue right now. The fact that I'm not at the next bracket in the pre awaken is huge right now. Because that means I have to use more pre awaken skills to, do, to kill someone. And I fucked up my cancel. Teleport to the wrong person, fuck. Okay, I think I desync, actually. Okay. Get the got the striker. I just died to AoE. Not even sure how. Okay, get out of there. The, uh... The Sage left. Ah... James Wally, let me, are we still alive? Yes, we are. Um, it's after war, so I am going to be on my way now. I could have gotten them, but I couldn't run away to recuperate my health. I got, I just got SA traded. Okay. I have him. Just need to. Wait, I... is that not? I thought that was. I thought that was unprotected on landing. I guess I was wrong. Which one? Corsair. Um, uh, oh, what did you invite me? Uh, okay, sure. What? Uh, DM me. Just DM... what's the name of your character? Um, family named Wally. Can you just type that to me? Cause I'm in the middle of PvP right now. I barely can concentrate. I don't even know what your name is anymore. Since. Remind me. Since. That's the character name. You're using character names in 2020. Okay, one sec. Not install on an inclined area.
Are you serious? Are they leaving? Where did I they go? I think so. I think they might have. I think they might have left. Are Are you serious? See, that actually brings me to another point. The thing with BDO is that when RPK starts, it take it can take you up to like 10 minutes in order to get to the PvP spot. Which is not really conductive to RPK. Like if you want RPK to start, like you call someone, people aren't gonna sit and wait 10 minutes for them to show up. They need to be here like immediately. And we had and that's like that was the thing that's possible in Perfect World. But on this game, not so much. Like, I get that there's immersion, but... Oh, it's worse, it's worse design in general. It looks like Wally is too late. This ninja wasn't in their group. The, uh, what's his face? The barcode ninja? What? I ran past the barcode ninja, is that? No, it was it was a guild called Not Touchy. Now some like... irrelevant. Like it's just one of my many complaints about trying to like get PvP started in this game. Where did they go? Like where would you go? RBF? Well apparently PvP is the least liked feature of this game. According to player polls. So GG, I guess. Time to play Naraka. Yeah, like like I said, I, I I don't think I will be playing BDO too much in the near future. Well, it was uh, nice of you to uh, come. But it looks yeah. like... It looks like the PK is over. Already. Well, that's fine, because my it's raining cats and dogs outside. I'm not sure... I need to do anything. So right. I will go there, that. No, if I was streaming seriously and I end up like coming out here for no reason, then the whatever content I had prepared afterwards gets delayed and then I lose the viewership. And then not having PK start is actually turns into a financial problem. I was very long winded. Oh, well, you know. GG. How Yes, that that is how it be. Where where is the uh, I guess they just okay. So either they went back to the grind spot, which is where they were originally, or they just left altogether. But where is the grind spot? Wait, how did how did I fail to grab? In that case, I'm going back to Gamla. I can come back anytime, anyways. All right, see you later then. What's the thing with this game, though? Oh, Going to Garmoth means it takes 10 minutes for you to come back. Oh, that's probably where they went. They probably swapped to their alts and went to Garmoth. Oh, you're right. Alright, well, in that case, I'm just gonna take a quick break and I'll be back once Garmoth is over. Wait, I fell down the cliff. I fell down the cliff. Oh my god, I can't get up. Time to quit this game. I mean, I oh. I doubt they just instantly swap to Garmoth. Why would you swap oh, to Garmoth right now? It makes sense, because uh, people prioritize different things, you know? Who is this uh, Milky Ninja? Why does he keep calling me Senpai? Because he was the one watching you uh, from the top of the rock, and he wants to know how you kill three people at once. Be back. I'm not even doing squirrel. Teach him nice combos? I don't know, it's just... Watch, uh... It's just watch combo guide on YouTube. I just do basic combos. I just I just do basic combos.
mean, personally, it's better. I think it's better to start by learning basic combos. I don't know, maybe I, maybe I should make a ninja guide and release it. What's what's the uh, situation? So people can stop asking me to teach them. It's time for action for you to actually do that. How do you pop shadow stun? Is he seriously just role-playing being a student with you? Maybe I'll just come over and kill him while he's asking you questions. He said he watched the combo guide though. So if he watched it, then this should already be explained in the guides. I'll put protein shake tastes like ass, what the hell? Just kill them with auto attack. Like this. I swear, if you watch the guy, you should know you can press RMB Shadow Stone. Oh, mega. Okay, I'm gonna go to the bathroom real quick, so I'm gonna be right back for like, I don't know, three minutes. Taking well, are you doing girl very, right now? very short break. Okay, I'm back already, actually. Welcome back. Thank you. 
So, the theory is that the PvP went to Garmoth? Is that why well, we have no one right now? Well, well, I have Sork. I have no stamina, gotta do a quick rotation. Oh, this is the Sork that was uh, in that guild earlier. Yes. yes. All right, where'd they at? Well, I told him to bring us guild again. I guess, uh, well, well, he should come now. I doubt Just one person alone can bring their entire guild, but maybe if uh, we kill them enough times. Fuck them, Nightmare. See? If you kill them enough times, then they'll be forced to bring their guild. Yes. Whereas if you just ask them to bring their guild, they won't. Okay, we'll flank him. This guy's too good. Not anymore. No, he's too good. He evaded us for more than 30 seconds. I'm just gonna spawn. But I'm pretty bad at chasing. <laughs> yeah, you kinda are. <laughs> you remember that time with the ninja? I think it was that exact ninja, actually. Bro, but see... <laughs> wait. It's the same ninja? Mm -hmm. You know what? You might be right. But see, uh, he uh, he peeled for you, so it was technically a one v two. I don't know what to tell you. Nothing I can do in that situation. Oh, I guess you got him. Never mind, I got nice him. Kill steal. Bro, I just used the meme attack. Which one? Ghost Claw. My Rob. third Rabon. It's not my fault he died to a meme attack. Yeah, he didn't knock him down fast enough. Alright, he's gonna go over here. For sure. Nope. He went this way. Are you serious? Why would he go back to spawn? The better question is why not? Because he knew that you were going to predict gonna you would go, go there. Wait. What? Kill him with auto attacks. Let's go. Fuck! Alright. Reset? Never mind. We got it. How long does spawn? Unity last, because I can just count from how many circles. But see, if he predicts that you're going to uh, predict he was going to go there, that's when you go back to spawn. I guess he is really good at uh, running away. He is super good at running away. Okay, but what is he doing now? He's not even trying to fight. I don't get it. I don't know. He's just like running in and then inting. It's it, you know what this sort of reminds me of. It's like when you desync and you or when someone else desyncs and you just see them running in the same direction over and over again. Like that's actually what he's doing. Okay, I'm, I I actually don't get what he's trying to do now. Neither do I. Like you, maybe maybe why, he's why, like why does he want to run that way? Maybe he's like uh, the sacrificial lamb that they sent us. <laughs> you know oh what? my god, he's doing it again! Let's let's investigate. Like let's see Which, where he's running. Let's see to. where. He, okay. Like, no, 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 I'm just gonna follow him. I'm, I'm literally just gonna follow him. Maybe maybe he has a secret place he wants to show us. You know. But let's just see sure. where he's going. All right. Oh my! I, I think he's gonna go grind. How much you want to bet he's gonna go? <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, he's a little bitch. I will grind him as well. All right, well, Garmoth is over. 
they they didn't come back. I will I will grind for him instead. I will grind the mobs for him instead, out of respect for his massive balls. I think it might be back to RBF. Oh damn it! PVP might be over. Unfortunate. Has my voice quality changed, by the way? Um, I think there's still minor improvement. But uh, since it's a $20 mic, it's not going to be as good, ultimately. I mean, that's fine. As long as there's minor improvement. There is a minor improvement, though, yes. Because having a mic is better than having no mic. Oh wait! I found the striker! He beat me 1v1. He's best striker. Okay, now where where is the rest of them? Oh, what do you mean he beats you 1v1? Yeah, I, I killed his partner 1v2 and then he killed me 1v1. No, that still means he beats you 1v2. Because you were distracted from killing his partner. No, I, I 1v1 him for like... Two minutes straight because uh, he kept resisting. Yeah, but he was uh, you were still distracted from the 1v2 fight for two minutes straight. So it's still 1v2. Um, are they back? I don't we're, know, we're I killed one of them. them. Yeah, we're trying to like kill the people that were involved in the fight and make them uh, call their guild back, but it's not working. Okay, this is a different guy. I guess... I guess uh, they're not even geared, so... No point. Oh, now you attack me, fucking Sork. That was the strategy all along. He pretends to not want to attack you, so then when you get... Oh my god, I just V'd out of the Striker's ulti. <laughs> That's really funny. Why would he ulti you? I don't know. Striker ulti is like really bad, just in small scale. Yeah, when you get overconfident, that's when he attacks you. Well, I killed them on B2 again. Oh no, it wasn't this striker, it was a different striker. I killed them. They're dead. But now, but now they're coming out of this spawn. Ah, uh, you're on the north rotation, okay. Well, I already log here, so I might as well. Yeah, guys, PvP might just be over. What can I say? Well, help me do my weekly then. I also have the weekly going on, actually. I, I see am, two uh, white dots here. I will politely refuse. I see two people here. It's uh, no touchy. Yes, that is correct. That is. Are these you're the ones for. that you're seeking? They they are the ones that we are seeking actually, but I think those two are just the ones that I killed earlier. Is it the striker and the sork? Wally is confirming with his Nobody, own eyes. Yeah, uh, because I'm fighting someone else right now. You are fighting. A do you want help? So where should I go? I see one I don't person do here. damage. Oh, I see the striker and the sork. Well, I will kill this Mewa as well. Wait, the sork just ditched the striker. He literally just ran away and while I was killing the striker, he could have peeled. He's not even trying at this point. He has given up all the I see someone on the top. How long until RBF opens? What is this? Is this the Sork? Alright, I guess we do I guess we do a bit of RBF. Oh, wait, there's wait. still people to kill. How's my health not full? I can't be performing force PvP mode. House must be fun taking damage over time. Okay, I guess we do a bit of RBF and uh, 
Wally can tell us if they come back or not. Wally, let's go do the 5,000, I guess. We can do, we can oh, do a lane while grinding West. people. Yeah, On I know. Road. Yeah, I'm checking. No, there's two. I'm vacuuming. Can you vacuum a second time? That would be cool. Nope, cool down. Uh, there should have been four people here, I thought. I don't see anyone in this RBF. What the fuck? Oh, there they are. Yeah, he has been killed. Pro him. All right. The OD comes out. Now I can just go for free stingers. Got a stinger. Now we go for down smash reset because style. I mean, yeah. I was gonna it's, use the Maraca uh, skill, so he was probably dead. He died. Yes. Oh, well, do you mind? Well, do you mind if I just farm them instead of helping you? Sure. Fuck. Well, you know, I can farm the mummy too if you want. If you want to go kill mobs. No, I don't really want to kill mobs. If I wanted to kill mobs, I'd just go on my main. You just tried full casting DoD in front of me. This enlightened guy is using simple Grom meal. In PvP. Uh, he might be stuck. He's just probably just stuck on... Uh... Hey Hunter Spike, welcome to the stream. Probably just stuck on simple from grinding. He could be, yeah, but still, it's pretty kick. Are we just gonna two v one him, or am I just gonna stand aside? I mean, I'm just gonna kill him over and over again. Okay, I'll go. Oh, we're just spot know, camping right I, now. Can I interest you in starting to listen to uh, late 19th century Prussian military marches? You can. Choice of music. That does sound like the type of music Neil would be interested in. Wait, what? How did he teleport? Oh my god. I did not I expect that. DM you right now. Oh, I guess he wants to put up a tent. Can you let me know, Wally, if you see one in Wild? Shit, I have to. Uh, I don't have B. Fuck. Or... Yeah, Serpent is uh, pretty good in season, though. But it's also That's kind of like extra strong because um, I don't have the next bracket on uh, Awakening. Because my Awakening, my pre-Awakening, pre-Awakening and Awakening are different brackets. Did he just be? I see someone at near me. Who is I'm this? I'm just Hawaii thinking. Panda, actually. Let me get out of here. Has logged in. Oh, I found this is pretty good. He has he's a... Also a shithead. He's a whatever. You went from stuck to awaken? Yeah, both stuck and awaken are pretty good right now, so definitely just uh, pick what you like to play. I only need to get the 3k mobs because I'm going to do some. I, I don't give a shit about like being super efficient with these, so I'll just do the rest with tomorrow's ring daily. You should probably be doing the ring daily as well, since it's just polys, and then at some well, point you. Can... I have no I have no intention of playing the circle though. Well, you're going to get it anyways. It's just why not? You never know. It never hurts to try. Yeah, uh, personally, I prefer Awakening more. 
So they're definitely pretty different styles. Awakening probably more heavy on uh, catching up on and CCing, whereas Succession is a bit more damage trading. Gonna go away, Kenny, because you're a gear let. Okay, LB. By the way, Mazap said that Katana Shower Bond was a uh, cheese. What do you think? Personally, I don't really think the bleed matters so much. With Awakening, you do so much damage on your actual hits that the DLT doesn't really come into play. Do I think a, it's a uh, Kanashao is cheese? I mean, what do you mean by cheese? Every class in this it's... game has a cheese. Who knows? It's Mazap said. I don't even play Ninja. But I guess he means that it's a safe... CC fish. I mean, that's, that's core skills in a nutshell, though. They're all cheese, according to that definition, because they're all super armor CCs or frontal guard CCs. Yeah, I have no idea what he means that it's cheese, to be honest. Actually, I think every single core skill that is popularly picked is a super armor CC of some sort. Yeah. Like, I don't think anyone, I don't think anyone chooses to go like a frontal core, unless well, it's like violation. Core, ser maybe. core serpent. People do cores. Use core serpent. Is the movement hard to learn? Um, well, when I was first learning Awakening Ninja, I guess the hardest thing for me was that uh, it's kind of like you have three different stands because you have pre-awake and awaken, but then you also have transition stands where you press R and B. Like that was kind of confusing for me at first, but once I got the hang of that, I didn't feel like it was too difficult. So there might be a bit of learning curve, but once you get the hang of it, it's all good, I think. you mind if I add on to that? What do you mean? For what? Because uh, movement behind people is very hard to do. Like, it's easy to move forward constantly, but moving behind people in a useful way takes a, takes a while. Ah. Uh... Because I'm still not good at moving on Sork. Even I don't though know. I, can, like, I, feel like... indefinitely. I feel like moving behind people on Waking Ninja is fairly simple. Because you basically have a Silent Charge, which you dash iframe, uh, and then you have Murderous, which is uh, dash CC. And then you just kind of like continuously rotate them. I, I, yeah, guess, it's, I guess it might be jump. difficult, more difficult on Sword, because the dashes are so short on Sword, except for yeah. Shadow Leap. Because like, cause like with Ninja, you have, right, you have Silent, you have Ninja, you have Shadow, and you have Ghost Greeting movement too, Block Jump. Okay, you don't need to uh, you don't need to move behind people. You just have to uh, hit them with the Karsh rock dog Karshans and don't they die and see okay, if I it fucked just up. kills them. This guy's gonna live, I think. Never mind, he dies. I fucked up my combo though. He's, he still died. Embrace the way of the gear checker, Neil. I mean, I kind of do an RBF. I'll just leave Karshans up as long as humanly possible and just like <clears throat> leap out at uh, at like twenty percent HP. That but, is basically the correct way to play Sork, yes. Uh, but yeah, I, th I guess Sork would be different, but I think Ninja is just a lot of... You go into Awaken, you transition to Awaken, transition stand, Silent Charge, Murderous, and then uh, something. And then do a, do, a, do, a, do the whole thing again, and just cycle that. I hit this guy and he literally just disappeared. What the hell? Instantly... Like, I, I, I hit him and he was gone. Instantly escape, escape, I guess. No. Of course, you're not gonna cycle it every time. It's gonna be... Like, when you're good, if you want to be, like, a good player, you have to, like, know when to use it, but... The but general concept is still want, the same. always want solutions they can use every time, and become frustrated when you tell them there isn't. Well, there are solutions you can use every time. It's just that Wait. you have to know when when you use it every time. You know, it's like the meme. It seventy percent of the time it works every time. Did you know Thief and Phylum are actually invisible when you don't have textures on? Wait, what the fuck? This guy's in stealth. Yeah. 
Alright, it's crashing waves again. Do you need help to kill him? Or? Did our... No, he's already dead. Where did the enemy oh. team go? Oh, they're over here. Shit. Also, the guild's not coming back. I just asked the, uh, the striker. So, uh, I guess... Wait, Wally, question. Fuck. Hmm? Also, I'm complete here, by which I mean I have 3,000 or 5,000, and it's all finished What happened tomorrow. to the 2v8 that they left? What was your question? Oh, I was just wondering why, like... Well, get the assisted DPS, I guess. Yeah, I hit him with the ability after he was already dead. Yeah, I don't know if they were gonna stay if Wally came earlier or if they were just leaving anyways, but... It's- it's the- it's the thing with RPK in this game. Like, people... It takes Please. a long time to get there, and then people leave early. Fucking like, like this, ga this game really needs teleports, though, I feel like. Or you can just teleport to any- like, any waypoint, but... They want the immersion, which... Kind of conflict with actually still having give good content. You, but they still give you fucking. They still let you double map, which is kind of stupid. Because it's not. You're neither. You neither have the immersion nor the instant transition. So you just have this weird mix where it's. Everyone's just doing their damnedest to exploit past the immersion because the immersion sucks. Are you still doing your daily? Kind I mean, of. you can. I'm I mean, talking to you. immersion isn't bad, but no, it, it can't. Bad. It can't conflict with actually having content. Like immersion needs to come second to content. If you were playing an RTS with immersion, then that means there should be like a thirty percent chance you just instantly lose all your army to dysentery. Uh, I don't know. I'm playing so... in remaster, so literally, that's pretty immersive. This is really Oregon Trail. Have either of you ever played Oregon Trail? No. I just know the memes. I actually have played it. It uh, it actually is pretty fun. Damn, where did where does he get the computer that can run Oregon Trails? No, I played it when I was like eight. Oh, okay. Did, did you just think that I was, like, using a virtual machine to run 2008? Yep. Windows 2008? Nice. That was Windows 2008, though. Is it 2008? I was in, like, I think third grade. It should just be 2000. Never heard of 2008. Or, uh, okay, or maybe okay. 98. Hmm, that would be are, even are older. Just... I'm pretty sure it's 98 that it runs on. Or maybe not. Okay, the enemy team is just like, being spawn camped. You're gonna get a stage rated to the death, Wally. Uh, I keep forgetting it's too diff- it, I keep forgetting this clash class can only dash to the side. And only really go to the side? I mean, to the back is a three-second cooldown. This, or rather, you can't, you can't, you can't, uh, you can't oh, flow out of going to, going to the front. All right, they came on this side. I really need to learn how to punish the uh, skedaddle followed by the stiff. No one should be using that. What do you mean? Boy, Pandas mm. use it all the time. It's like a mini midnight stinger. It's way too slow to be called mid Midnight Stinger. He should be trying to just kill you with damage. I mean, the thing is, is he does it consistently, and if you aren't prepared for it, it actually works a lot of the time. Like, I, I've gotten used to the idea that he's doing it, so I can, like, go for punishes, but I don't know the exact timing to get it every single time. So I'll just end up, like, hitting his dash, or hitting whatever he does next after I think if you just go for only slash. damage, you just get grabbed. When he brings down the blade and the wave starts coming out, that is unprotected. That is starts. That's when the SA ends. Called whirling slash. Oh fuck. Yeah, and I just wanna. 
the thing is, is it's range, so I just want to know the timing for it. Like, I haven't mastered the timing since I've never dueled one seriously. Because, like, mm -hmm. all the times that I've dueled people has been, like... One sec, he's, he's on. I lost 100... Oh, no. I gave 159 points. Fuck. Bro, that happens all the time. That's, like, the classic RBF move. Well, see, the problem you is, once I start losing points, I just never get it back. Ah, I see. I'm just, I'm not really good at RBF, that's the thing. Because, uh, you, you play for kills, not points. What is this? Which Trash makes me money? a bad player. Because I should be oh. playing, I should be playing for objectives. Yeah, see, I should be playing for objectives. I guess this person just wants to grind, so I guess you can kill him if you want. Oh yeah, uh, wait. See, I, lost, I, I gave away another 127 because I wasn't playing for objective. Wait, what, what are you congratulating me on? What? Uh, your latest video release. What do you mean, congratulations? I'm glad to see that your work has been, uh, that you got rid of some video. I mean... I have, like, way too much in the backlog, though. What else is in your backlog right I mean, now? I'm supposed to make the guide, I'm supposed to do, like, video analysis of, uh, Mass BK. I'm supposed to, um, make, uh, content for Naraka Blade Point. I even Wait. have, like, some spell break footage that, uh, I was gonna release and I never got to. I have like I have more than I really can handle at this point, which is kind of bad. I, I need no, a, I need to like him. go through the footage faster. You need the uh, co-pilot for video footage, I guess. That's what you said. Yeah. Is that okay? Can you explain that to me? Is that relatively new? Because I haven't heard of uh, GitHub co-pilot. Yeah, it's relatively new. So basically, you want to use someone else's processing power to review videos for you? Mm, no. Must be his own eyes. What Wayne wishes he had is uh, a way for him to separate his video processing skills in his brain and then just paralyze it massively. So you you know how GitHub Copilot basically what I, I it does? I don't know what it is. It's, it, I just well, that's what I'm concepts. saying. Basically, what it does is yeah. that um, it uses the uh, GPT-3 language uh, model, and it basically uh, is able to understand what you want it to do like you can type in natural human language tell it what what code you want and it will actually be able to generate code based on its understanding of your human text and like okay so when you enter a code is it like into a, a query system or is it like does it just read automatically what you've already written or are you like typing it into some sort of interface or what uh, it, it, like, it integrates with your uh, it integrates with vs code so with your ide so like you can oh, so like so like you can like write a comment saying uh like I don't know this function uh returns the current date and then it will automatically understand that and then uh, write like give so you a like, code yeah. that gener generates the current date. Mm -hmm. So it's and it, it does this dynamically or do you? Yeah, use this AI. Interesting. So see, this is the part where I CC my project manager and say please I've tagged my team for. For their information. So basically, and if it if it's able to be understood under the GPT three model, then it uh, Actually, is able to generate. See. So let me search what the GPT three model is. It's the uh, latest, Generative most advanced auto model for natural language. Okay, open AI. Processing. Okay, nice. Twenty twenty release. And it's okay. probably the model that's used that was used uh, for your um, the uh, simulation, the patient simulation you did. Honestly, probably. Yeah, because it's pretty advanced right now. It's able to basically generate uh, entire articles that people that's difficult to distinguish as a computer written rather than human written. So it might it may actually pass the Turing test potentially. But then again, Turing the, uh, test isn't really 
that, um... Grand test has been passed for years now, I believe. Like, it, I mean, it's kind of ill-defined, though, because it it's based a lot on whether the judge thinks that it's human-like. So it's very subjective rather than objective, that's the thing. So you can, like, write a non-AI program that just behaves like a human with, like, under certain inputs, and if a judge, like, don't investigate further, they could say it passes. So it's, not, it's a just, subjective yeah. measurement, not, like, an objective measurement. And, but... and plus, you can kind of, like, overfit, where you just have it write language that kind of, like, blocks the conversation so that the person can investigate further as well. Yeah. But, uh, but so, so like, what I really mean is that it basically generates very human-like text at this point. It's like, it's uh, hard to distinguish that's being computer-generated. Where, where's the... 800 points! What, what's the oh, fuck, I didn't get the kill. What's God the training it. material? What's the training material for the language it generates? I have no idea. You have to probably is read up on GPT-3. No, not GPT-3, but, like, the code that it's generating. Uh, so apparently that's kind of controversial because they said that it uses other code that's been uploaded to GitHub to train it. And some of them apparently are not licensed to be trained, to be used in the training model. So they might have actually broken some license agreements by doing it. Really? And exactly how many people are going to get in their face about it? Oh, plenty. There was this huge controversy about like Apple oh, five, five, using four. there there was there was like this huge controversy about like Apple that took a couple hundred lines of code from I think like uh was it like Android or something? But anyways, they like started ubiquitously using it in their code. And there was just like a recent lawsuit that filed in favor of Apple saying that a few hundred lines of this code is not enough to call copyright infringement. And if you're putting out like Code, you should expect part like small parts of it to be used in that fashion. Like you can't intellectually copyright ten million lines of code, stuff like that, which is kind of interesting because then you have this it's, perspective it's, where you have like a bunch of small companies using big hmm. companies' code, but you also have big companies that are able to steal like uh, some sort called. of startups innovation. Yeah, interesting. But I guess it kind of makes sense because there's only so many ways certain things things can be written so if you like are able to copyright arbitrarily small portion of code then it might eventually become impossible to write new code yeah so like how many ways are there to like invoke invoke a date function you know yeah so that could be one that could be one angle they're looking at just uh create your own calendar i guess but yeah so basically yes. With that in mind, what I was hoping for is that maybe I can have a, if I could have a way that sorts out my video so I can query it based on uh, how many kills I get over how many durations over, uh, like, wh where I was at, you know, every stuff like that would make things well, way easier. Apparently, keep, no, keep live notes as you go of um, what times in what VOD you have interesting clips. But just, just the, but the first time, the but like just the first time going through it, it's already so long. Maybe you should uh, classify all your clips and then use that as training data. So the funny, <laughs> so what I do with my See. clips is I will actually stop and stop every day and uh, rename them. Uh, you know, class name, uh, game mode. And then timestamp by seconds, and then where uh, and then what manner of thing um, I noted down. But see, that's so the thing. So that you... is the um, administrator's approach to. That's the uh, manager's approach to. Uh, the I problem, don't. But I see, I don't. I don't have time to go over every. And... I don't have time to go over it every day, though. Oh no! I just. Okay. No one's I... here. Actually, clips. I actually will write things down as I go, so that I know when it was. See, see, the real thing is Wayne should be uh, doing that shadow play recorder, and then uh, just modifying it so that every time he presses it, it'll also record his voice, and so he can like shadow clip something and say pentakill, 
and then uh, the voice trans will tra be transcribed uh, to the, the file name. The shadow play is that the uh, quality is awful. Really? Or rather, it's not to the level that Wayne wants. I mean, if we can configure the NVIDIA shadow play and then have it like automatically clip every time I kill someone and then also save like the past, I don't know, one minute. That could actually be uh, helpful. That's how shadow play works, though. That's literally. No, what you have to. Is. You have to enter the command in that. Like you have to press the button. Sometimes you just forget. I don't know. I never. I never use shadow play, because I know, like on the Rocket Waypoint and all sorts of Legend Online, they have the feature to automatically clip your kills. Uh yeah, they clip all my kills on AFK bots. Thrilling, really. But I mean, for those games, they they don't have to like interact with anything. It, yes, that it is a good innovation. No, no, what, I, I, wait, what I mean, are you like, what are you talking about right now? So like, so like, the games can obviously record the highlight kills, right? Because yeah. they have access to kill information. Well, you can't do that visually with like a third party program. Yeah. And you also can't access the program, like you can't access the packets itself on BDO. Yeah, so it wouldn't work for BDO. But for other games, maybe I could set it, try setting it up. Perhaps just use what, um, what the Naraka fuck? does. Wait, you can control the pet? On Nova? Yeah. I, thought it, I thought it auto attacks. Oh, uh, no, you can uh, you can make it attack. It The motion to, the skill to do it is super armor. I didn't know so that. So you just have a super armor in no cooldown range stiffen. Wait, I thought it was an auto attack on Purple. I thought There's it was like if they attack you, it attacks them. They do that. But you can also they direct do that the at pet. Like 40% HP. 30% HP? It'll the pet will the also people. aim at you. Uh, the, the pet can also be directed to land on you for another ability. Okay, what the, the cancer's thing is that the pet's back attack. Like, fuck you. The pets can legitimate same gear, the pets can just kill you. Okay, I'm just, I'm just inting. I, I didn't seem to see the mystic. Holy fuck. That's why, like, you can say that Suck Nova pretty much plays itself. Really does. But it's just like Tamer then, right? Well, it's ta it's everything Tamer wanted to be and more. It's like Tamer, but the pet... Like, the pet control concepts are similar, but the pet effects are much greater. Like, you can't get the Tamer pet to go behind someone, for example. These will automatically. Oh, so it, so you, you can't so you can't use frontal guard. Uh, against nope. the against the minions you can't against the pawns. Okay, because I because I just because I just wasn't able to use the frontal guards just now. Against yeah. the calc, it will it hits behind you as, at the same time. Yeah, the the calc will like do an AOE continuously where it goes in front of you and then behind you, and then the minions just spawn behind you. I think. Okay, so maybe I should just use Frontal Guard first before it spawns, and then switch to uh, switch to Super Armor after. Probably. Oh, yeah, I'm at like three thousand. I might just stop it. No, it's just stop. Uh, I'm not even. I don't know if I'm even getting your kills. Oh, I, I guess I am. Well, I, I just got in range. Cool. Yeah, I think I'm gonna stop. I'm gonna go look yeah. for people one last time. Like, I feel like the bone skills actually really changed the meta a lot, though. Because you can't randomly fish? Because you can randomly just rely on randomly fishing. Yeah, well, you, you can't. Can randomly... You, you can you only can fish with other bone skills. What I mean is, bone skills allow someone to just endlessly use their bone skills. But uh, I guess I just killed the... them. Oh, okay. Like, everyone um, is so much more protected moving... now. I was moving using the whirling slash and he just died because he ran into the projectile. Like frontal guard used to be pretty reliable, but now it's like so many skills just outplay it. Wait, what do you mean outplay frontal guard? Like so many skills oh, just break they frontal guard instantly. Past. They travel past frontal guard. And, and their super armor. So let's see, the let's let's go through the classes. So uh, Sork picks are usually Grim Reaper or Blades for 1v1. So those are both super armor. But they don't go behind people. Well, the they hash, do. The, hash, mean, the, just, the Blades go behind you. Well, Blades, yeah, I guess. If you're in front of a sword. They don't tunnel, though. 
No, they well, I guess they kind they of do. they kind of tunnel. They moved to your previous position, which I guess is pseudo tunneling. Um, spiral. I know spiral cannon is popular there for you know, mystics. Spiral can uh, torpedo for mystic. Cannon for sword or er, striker. Um, so that's that's a tunneling anti frontal guard super armor skill. The hash one is very similar. Oh my god. Okay, I guess this person will be on. Oh my god. I did not expect that. I thought I was blocking. The Corsair one is also a frontal guard that goes behind you. Or the super armor that goes behind you. I think that's just a prime skill. I'm gonna try to fight this guy while overweight. And then the long one is now a protected one that goes behind you. Like like with with the with the new bong skills, right? So many protected skills that go behind you now. Guess he's not going to attack me while I'm overweight. So it's like you also need. One sec, I need to concentrate. Frontal guards. Or super armor. Wait, what the fuck? I thought flashing light would move me further back than that. Jumped instead of using a smoke screen. Let's grab. Okay. Someone explain to me why people. S well, can you kick me out of the call really quick? I need to concentrate. Sure. Did you do it? How do you kick people out of the call? Let's just move them to a different call or disconnect them. Any, any. There's multiple ways to do it. Okay, this works. I just I move both of us instead of him. Why not just move him? What? Because my mouse is double clicking and it went to you instead. But yeah, my mouse has started double clicking. So trying to I'm play diplomatic. Even... Oh. God. So what were you about to ask? Why is it that people still think that you can get banned for PKing? Wait, who just told you that? Some what? random I ran. Some random I one tapped at Polly. I don't know. I feel like they're maybe just memeing. I doubt. I doubt anyone genuinely believes you can get banned for PKing on Arsha. Like, like that's that's just a bit out there, you know. I think Care Bears are actually that dumb. No, I, mean, no, no, no. I, I think I think they're PVE only play. I, you have to be dumb. You have to lose a certain amount of brain cells to be a PVE only player. What do you mean you used to be a PVE only player? And I was fucking dumb. <laughs> I don't know about that, but okay. I guess I will watch Neil. Who is he fighting? Wait, so I didn't die when I was CC, but then I die in iframe. What? How does that make sense? Let me tell you about the dot stack build. No, but I was literally taking no damage and when I was CC in knockdown. So I, that's when I should have died, not when I get up in an iframe. Oh, that's just... Oh, you know, you know how... I might as well... I guess I ended up just finishing my... That's with... that's not how it should work, though. Okay. Thanks, Wally. Uh, sorry if I sounded rude. I just wanted to kill them all first. No, no, it's it's fine. I was just telling Wayne I ended up having to move both of us instead because my mouse was double-clicking. And it grabbed him instead of you when I tried to click on you. 
Ah, but perhaps moving the two of you is the same thing as moving it one of me. It's the same thing, but it's just more effort. Ah. It is, it's, it's like the... Sufficiently small amount of effort difference where... I guess an organization would just roll with this process instead because it's not worth the time to update, to um, investigate updating the process. Yes, it's the same reason that uh, companies still rely on people to fill out spreadsheets instead of just having an algorithm do it. Uh, I don't know. I feel like having to having a broken mouse is a pretty big problem. I don't know about you. Oh yeah, I will attempt to solder a new switch as soon as I convince. As soon as I might talk to my dad and convince him there is no other recourse. I guess Nobody's... he says skirmish. Nice. To which I, mean, I say dead just, guild. You can always just buy a new mouse, I guess. Ah, yes, oh. Wally. What's up? Did you notice that there's no echo? I figured you were just not on speakerphone. Yes, I, uh, I bought earpods. Wait, what? Apples. Oh my god, I keep getting CC through silent charge. What is silent charge for if not to be CC'd in? That's the real question. Alright, did, did you get a X. did you get a nice mic or are you just using the built-in headphones? I'm using I'm using the built one watch from the Apple earpods. I like the feel of them in my ears relative to other ear like. How's oh, this guy so tanky? What the fuck? Because I should watch your stream. What the fuck was that? Or Sarah, I guess. I thought this guy was succession for some reason. Oh, hash, interesting. I thought it was succession that had the instant block jump. None of them have the instant block jump anymore. What do you mean? He's just instant block jump. It was nerfed. Well, there's no, a small the, animation. The, okay, the, this small animation I can't even react to. That that, okay, matter. then that's basically instant. Yeah. I can't, I can't even react to it. I want, I literally want Kyrene do it, and I couldn't react to it. On top of that, they can hide the animation in their core skill. Oh my god. Almost. I had to res I had to use Serpent because I wasn't going to kill him otherwise, but then that was too risky. Did they kill you instead? It's like... Yeah, well, of course. See, that's that's why you're uh, not playing for objective. Because if you're playing for points, then you would have just went out since you know you're not going to get the kill or get the kill and die. Well, I mean, I feel like it was a good chance. I just didn't expect him to come all the way from the back where I didn't see him. Ah, yes, the uh, the ninja non-ninjas. Like, at that moment, I didn't really see any immediate threat, but then uh, someone came out well, in the middle of my serpent and then CC'd me. Yeah, that, that happens a lot to me too. So, that's why I'm not good at RBF, because there's too many walls. I can't, Mystic avoids I, me. It's hard for me to see people through the wall. Well, you do have the damage to kill him. I'd have to land as full CC. Damn, the vacuum, I guess. I will very helpfully kill mobs next to you guys. Wait, the fuck? Oh my god, I don't have the damage. Where's my? What the fuck? Where was my only shadow? I kept I pressed that like three times. Wait, you said you can't kill him? I can kill him. Oh, okay. the damage. All right. I just like. I think I just like. Hit six down smashes without knowing which, if any of my skills actually down smash. Not DPSing optimally. 
I was told the uh, the mermaid travel skill Wait. actually has a down. I thought I thought Nova only has the pet once they're low HP. What? What? No, they they anytime they press Q block, they have the pets out. What? I thought it was only when they're low HP. Okay, which no. which pet are you talking about? Because they have pawns and then they have like the demon thing. Uh, the soldiers. But uh, they also have the dragon. Like the dragon is at thirty percent. No, they dragon also have it. Is... They have it even before thirty percent HP sometimes though. Yes. No, if if you have the ability, then your your skills will summon Calc. What do you mean if you have the ability? Well, you uh, well you have succession skill, then your abilities will summon Calc. Is it Calc? It's Calc. It's a Calc. I I don't I get thought... what you mean by that. So so do they have the Calc before thirty percent HP or no? Because yes, I, I feel like they do. They do. They okay. do. They have. It's. Uh, it's just an. Uh, it's. Think, okay, think, of, think of it. Think of it as they have every single pet, all the time, and then they also have like an auto response below a certain percentage HP if they're uh, on the ground, or even even if like they just have an auto response as well on top of that. Okay, so then it is like tamer. So I don't know. I don't know what people are saying. I mean, when you say it plays itself. I mean, it's tamer with a. Unbreakable block. That's super armor. I mean, the nice thing is that they can't really kill you if, uh, if you like. You can sort of, yes, you can just kind of bypass them, certainly. Because honestly, there's like this one, there's like this one Nova that I told to go succession because he wasn't having a fun time with, uh, Awakening. And I was just like, go suck Nova. And now these days, I just ignore him in RBF. I just like walk past him. Oh yeah, because they're not a class. The Are one that? place where Nova works out really well is uh, unironically Siege, because uh, if you lose a barricade, if you lose a wall, no problem. The Nova goes stands there and goes jacking off. I mean, are they having fun now, though? Uh, yeah. They are having fun, actually. Interesting. Playing fucking suck Nova? I mean, if you're watching something at the same time, yes. If he I, needs I mean, to... I mean, what he does is he sets up the wall and then he gets a drink of water, or he says he gets a drink of water. So, what I, I can do is we roll to suck Nova and then like do my drawing practice while I RBF. No, no, no. See, the real the real strategy is to get three suck Novas and then just have them form a triangle. Literally an impenetrable wall, and then you just stack that with shy bubble. Hey, Art of Four, how are you doing? Huh? Oh. He's talking to chat. Yeah, it's show, I guess. It's it's the Meeper. No, it's the shield wall. The shield wall. See, so, I wonder if that would actually have like up? potential applications. Can you no, think of it's any... too fucking slow. You just it's almost time for him to go sleep. People are just gonna walk past you. No one. I, don't know, cares. I was like, is there is there an application to a triple Nova triangle? Not really. Really? I mean, potentially, if your if your flag if your if your guild's flag is being pushed, and then three suck novas just stand in a circle around it and absorb damage. But one, you're being pushed by sixty people. You're just your your guard will actually break. Uh, Ninety nine points. Two, you're gonna get grappled. So it's not really good at RBF. There's no one here as well. And I'm uh, so I'm just I guess I guess I'll probably do like a few more rounds of RBF, and I probably uh, end the stream and get ready to sleep. I mean, we had PvP today. It was just uh, less than we could have enjoyed. I think today's um, more of an RBF day, though. I mean, seasonal content. I guess I had uh, BR Digital Corrupt versus. What was it? Chill crawling and what was the third guild? Oh, chill crawling vertex. Oh shit! I don't have a. Uh... Fuck my alchemy stone right now. Whatever. I guess you're gonna play well permanently slowed. Nice. No longer neutrals, I guess. I mean, siege isn't really. Even good content though, so. Yeah, see, so just getting gear capped, by the way. 
Yeah, like that's ever right. gonna happen. No, it's 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 already gear capped on Korea. As I I I, I don't night. I don't believe it. I'll believe it when I it's, see it. It's literally in the patch notes. I'll I'll believe it when I see it. It's gear capped to like two seventy three and C nine armor. So yeah, and I'll believe it when I see it. Okay. Wait, what the fuck? The... I I was I should have been in iframe frame with that grab. Um, I'll link you the KR patch notes, I guess. Uh, no, I'll believe it when I see it. On NA? Yep. Sure. The, I'm sure the Koreans are happy to beta test for us, because the with that cap, you're not pushing the castle. You're just going to run into the choke and get farmed by rage classes on the wall. Honestly, there has been very few things that P has done right, so... It's as fair a criticism as any. Does that hit CC on every hit or what? The hash uh, roll. Yes, it's multi hit. So that's why. One more mechanic that really needs to go multi hit CCs. You know, if they really want, they could always just bring us back to like the pre-CC changes, you know? Like that, that seems to be the direction they're going, so... Maybe they can just undo all their changes. Everything's protected and just RNG evasion procs. Well, there was less RNG back then because um, CC resist was tied to... Uh, For hits, like the, hits. Um, the hits, yeah, so... But on top of that, it also, be a, it also was attached to hit confirmation by accuracy. So you could just go evasion and not get CC'd. I think that's even fuck, even more fucking stupid. So imagine someone just going full evasion. You just never CC them because it's not a good slant. Like I said, that's even more fucking stupid, honestly. Well, they can't kill you if they go full evasion, so I think that's fine. Laughs and getting gear checked. Who is this? Oh, it's the mystic. And plus, wasn't there like a thing that made Evasion not as good back then as well, or am I imagining it? What the fact that um, if anything, it was kind of better because like all of the new classes have like thirty percent accuracy just passively. I are you sure? I remember no one going Evasion back then. What was the reason? Because, because they wanted to go no, because you had to go accuracy to kill people. So everyone was still going damage. So then evasion is worse than back then. Back then, but today the average gear score is like six eighty. But people still go accuracy. Yeah, they're still going damage. But now they have. Uh, but now you can also have C C twenty evasion with six gold um, evasion accessories. And a Tet Fallen God, which seems to be pretty prevalent these days. I mean, who doesn't have Tet Fallen God? Me. Me. Because I'm a gear lad, I'm not even 680. <laughs> Only have one pen accessory. I'm trying to remember what I ate today. I'm curious how many calories I ate. Um, yeah. I will go another day. I've wasted about another 100k agris because I just can't bring myself well, to grind. I mean, at this rate, they're pretty much we're pretty much going back to the meta anyway. So what's the difference? Well, it's just that. it's the same meta at a higher. It just takes higher to get the gear. The only difference is that um, you you can't infinite combo someone anymore. Because uh, back then, you could just do standing CC back to back until someone got on the ground. And after that, the only option to continue CCing someone on the ground was down smash or grab. But I thought even back then, you couldn't. it was pretty much only three, like 2 to 3 CC because uh, every successive CC like uh, had the less and less chance of succeeding. I Wasn't mean, that you, the still, you, you still got like 6 or 7 CCs really? in a row. At least, at least the ones that I saw in like the old Ranger montages. 
They would get like a stiff, followed by a knockback, followed by a stiff, then a stun, then like a knockdown, then a grab, or something like that, then down smash. Neo. Yes? What's what up? do you think of if uh, you... If there was no CC limit, no CC resist, but um, you could not, you could not CC people that are on the ground. You could only CC people who are standing or in the process of roaming. And then you had a uh, CC escape mechanic that was on, say, 15 second cooldown. Uh, so Elia? I, I think it would be fine without the CC escape mechanic. But the thing is, is that the fights in this game, you only get like a CC once every like what, two minutes, I would say, in a high level fight, once every one or two minutes, um, when both players are playing it. So if you had like a CC escape on a 15 second cooldown, then neither player would die, unless it was like full It would be a super armor CC uh, escape that uh, you could mind game. He says talking about Elio. No, I'm, I'm thinking no, of playing so. No, I, I still, I, I still think like, yeah, because, because I thought he was CC. What like, the fuck? Because like, if you say it's to escape a standing CC, then uh, oh wait, what do you mean? So like, a 15 second immunity, like fortify? No, it will be a uh, you get knocked down, you can roll up. But de uh, depending on what you do when you get when you get rolled, if you get caught while rolling up, then you're done, because then you don't have a CC escape anymore. And then we just remove V as a mechanic because V is pretty terrible. So wait, you can so 15 second cooldown and it just lets you get up from any ground CC. Yes, you'll be like a roll off. It's like so, it's, so, it's so like, like the so like the knockdown roll up, except you can use it immediately and it's on 15 second. Cooldown. Yes, I don't do think you, you can like do make you these remember, changes to BDO without like having major changes to skills though. Do you remember the? LMA combo and the uh, the inherent little bit of mind game that went with after uh, the grab. Whether they rode, if they rode, you, you yeah. used okay. the like, ground like, Honestly, I think, that's, I, I think that wouldn't really make a difference because so many classes have like such high CC output that unless you did it while someone was like in an animation locked, super long damaging skill and just did that, when, when they couldn't punish your roll or your recovery, then all of the classes in the game could pretty much like instantly CC a roll up. And then for play, for classes like Tamer, it would be even more trivial because you would just set up like a stiff area of effect. And the moment they roll up, they just get re-stiffed. Is the YouTube video going to happen soon? Wait, which YouTube video are you talking about? Are you talking about the guide or the montage? I mean, it would have to be an eye. Then in that case, it would have to be an ice cream CC escape. And then the mind game would have to be where you land, except once again we have the issue of giant AOE CCs. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I, like, I think the mechanics are good, but I don't think they have a place in BDO because of how convolutedly OP this the CC is. This game, it's I don't, like, like either huge or multi-hit or extremely fast or multiple CCs at the same time. Like BDO is just a much faster game. I don't think you can take like a mechanic from a slower game, insert into BDO, and expect it to work. Like, BDO is probably one of the fastest MMO out there. Like, I mean, I guess what you could do if you wanted a recovery mechanic is you could emulate Super Mario Smash Brothers. Um, because they also have, like, a recovery mechanic. And then there's, like, different ways you can recover off of a ledge. Because I want to the recovery mechanic to be counterplayable. It's like, it's like what, you, what, what you do in Smash, right, is you can recover and jump, or you can recover with a get-up attack, or you can just get up extremely fast, or stuff like that. So you get some interesting rock, paper, scissors mechanics. So it would have to be like the same thing yes. in BDO. So... so like maybe maybe you could have a super fast roll up that has uh, like it's either it's vulnerable. A, roll, grab, roll, a vulnerable roll up grab versus an iframe roll up, and then you're like like uh, it, could be as, it could be like a slow telegraphed iframe, or it could be like an instant iframe or it could be like an instant recovery that's very very fast not instant but unprotected and then you can also have one that's like frontal guard but also has like a stiff hatch to the front or something like that that's that's actually exactly how bns it works in bns which was what i'm actually always i was actually trying to um verbalize e G. because you everyone had their um tab skill which was essentially v because it got you out of everything. 
And then you had some other options, which I don't remember because I haven't played PNS in years. You had to ask Twizzy. Uh, the ninja guide. I have that, uh, I mean, I kind of, I'm kind of like thinking I might have to rethink some of the guy the things I wrote in the guide. Because I have like a initial draft, but I don't know. Or skills. I think with or like, skills. with bone skills, I have to like change some of the things I wrote. So it's probably like not in anytime soon. I mean, what would you change? Because CC fishing is still CC fishing. You just have to learn how to count cooldowns. 30% unprotected movement time and no grabs, perhaps. But that doesn't work for your skill. I mean, I, I basically fish against every new class. Like, I, I don't know what Sage does, really, except for like a few skills, a few core skills. So I just fish for CC after <laughs> counting their main CC. But like, Sage is just going. If a Sage doesn't want to be CC, they can just neutral and neutral and neutral. And... I mean, the thing is in this game, is that I'm, I, I was like, I was talking about this in the story. One of the main problems in this game is that you cannot forcibly slaughter someone. Like, everyone has their own equivalent of turtle. Like, Sorks, I frame forever. Warrior, hold down Q block. And then just like, I frame to recover block or HP. And then Val, same thing. Hatch, you just rotate for Windows. Ninja, you just rotate iframe neutral uh, with murder towards like transition stance. And then Sork, you literally just iframe. So, like, every class like can turtle really, really effective. Um, Striker just rotates super armor. Well, that's so, why like, you play a grab is... class. Huh? That's why you have to play a grab class, I guess. Yeah, so, like, so like the only solution is either you have just absurd damage or uh, grab. Yes. And the thing about turtling in this game is that it takes far less skill to turtle than it takes to actually kill someone in like an aggressive fight. So like, for example, if a striker doesn't want to die to a sword, or if a mystic doesn't want to die to me, they literally just press F. Whereas I have like a whole host of mechanics that I have to do if I want to kill them. Um, so they can kind of just like deny both of those fights. Because they're not, they're not going to kill me either while they're just turtling. Because Turtling poses no threat, but it's it's just really annoying that low skill player can deny someone ability to, to forcibly slaughter them. That's an interesting thought because going along with the fact that the majority of the players on this game hate force PvP. I don't know. I think it's just the thing with Sork though. Like some classes, you probably need more effort than others. Like. I don't know. It's... Sage, you can probably forcefully slaughter people with pure damage. That's fine, I think. Yeah, that's what that's what he said. It's one of the only ways to force the yeah, pure, pure damage to have pure, either you have a grab or you have pure damage. Yeah, so I think that's a uh, class by class basis, rather than but, like uh, going back to what you were saying, Neil. Would you say that it, the game was designed in such a way that it's the neutral is essentially the, the noob can the the noob tube the rocket launcher the easy mechanic uh, i see what you're saying i see what you're saying. I, I don't because think so because people don't like no, to be okay, okay. No, 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 no. People I, like I, to be forcefully slaughtered right i i i actually think that the noob tube in this game is brown i mean it's I both don't think so. neutraling. i don't think there really is a noob tube in this game Oh, sure there it is. It's dash, grab, dash on Sage. Mm, that really doesn't work against uh, experienced players, though. The whole idea no, of the noob tube is that it works against experienced players, somewhat. Like, occasionally. Oh, yes, the dash, 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 grab, dash okay. does work okay. versus... Uh, like, it, like, it doesn't, though. No, I, I would say it doesn't. Okay, so in that case, a better a better idea might be the wake-up grab. like Or, like, wake-up CCs from resist. I think that's the real noob tube. Yeah, resist for sure, I think. Because like a noob yeah. can just outplay completely by getting CC, taking half a combo, and then just immediately counter CCing on the wake up. I think I think that's the real noob tube of this game. Yeah, I would say so. Because the whole idea of noob tube is that it works against experienced players. That's not every time, but it definitely, but it still works. It's like just enough times so that the experienced player doesn't quit and that the noob player feels like they did something. You know. Um. I do, I do think it is more of a class-by-class class basis problem, this problem of, like, 
unable to break turtling. The, yeah. the discussion, the discussion you comes up because you can't break the turtle. Because like for Sork, I have I've heard so many people on the Sork Discord complain that they like can't kill a striker or something, or they can't kill a warrior that's just holding Q block. And like every time I think to myself, well, you they can't kill you either. Like. What, what, what is a striker gonna do to you that, that is gonna harm you while they're super armor cycling? Like, literally nothing. Their super armor cycles are all melee, they don't travel. What What is a warrior gonna do that threatens you when they're holding Q block? Grab, why are you standing next? Just stand a bit farther away. They literally can't harm you one player. And so this discussion came up because I'm like, every, like, ton of Sork is like, I can't forcibly kill this person. And I'm like, they can't kill you forcibly either if you just iframe. Like Sork literally never runs out of iframe unless it's playing super aggressive. And then you have, and then you make one v ones into the fucking node wars where every fight is a stall. Yeah. No one can win. And, and that's that's my original point. I I feel like it's easy to stall. In some one melee class other than ninja have good accuracy passive. Well, ninja doesn't have good accuracy passives. Ninja oh, is a class guess. that needs a lot of accuracy. Sage doesn't need accuracy. No, yeah. we can say that you want accuracy because and probably you only have nine percent. Ranger, you don't need accuracy. You kind of do for uh, because of just um... just hit three hundred five AP. Wait, are you sure? I people were saying Woking Sage doesn't need accuracy. They can go for RBF. That's that's what I was hearing too. Uh, I mean, you you get nine percent. It's not like I was. Insane. I heard I heard way more than nine percent. I heard thirty five percent. Yeah, people were saying that uh, in Awakening okay, Sage. Sorry, you get, like... I forgot the pass. I forgot about the passive. Because it gets 30% knockdown resistance ignore, and then on top of that, I heard it like keeps up 30%. It's 9% on uh, radiant destruction and then the passive, which I forgot to mention. You forgot, uh, I forgot all about. That's why 15. You can get 15% if you use the pre awakening buff, but it takes forever to buff, so no one uses it. I don't know, man. <sighs> and then Nova, Nova, right? Is it Nova? Nova is a high, high uh, accuracy class as well, right? Awakening Nova? Can't tell. Their fucking base modifiers are so big, they might as well have 100% hit rate, because any hits that hit through evasion will just kill you. Okay. I guess we could look at it that way. I heard Nova is a good class. Nova is a good class. It's. It, I told you, it's. Imagine. Blasting Gus in the penetrating wind combo, but you yourself are the penetrating wind. Yeah, because like it also that's, travels. That's that's literally just common, isn't it? It's like a nine second unprotected knockdown that just moves through targets. It's yes. what I've experienced. But you don't even comet. Huh? You you just you just dash and uh, dash left click into people and dash left click and then bond uh, shift R and B, which is protected float and be Yeah, because like because like. All, Once all I've really experienced, to, you know, stupendous amounts of damage. It's like all I've experienced against Nova is literally just Comet, the protected flow ball, and like once I see those two things are down, I just int onto them until I die. Like I haven't fought any good Novas yet. This thing. Um, if you fight me, I will just uh, once those go down, I will C swap, back myself against the wall, uh, press Q, and get myself a coffee. Nice. El Clasico, the well, coffee. This ranger doesn't zero damage. What the fuck? Oh. No, ranger. Ranger, ranger in cap gear is fucking dog shit. Wait, this ranger actually has zero damage. What? Yeah, he probably doesn't have gear. But he has 80 points. If you stay alive long enough as a range class, eventually you get last hits. Oh, I can. I don't even have to count anymore. What the fuck? Also, isn't he Succession? Uh, I think yeah, he's succession. succession Seasonal is even worse. Really? View my stats. Accuracy. Rate. Oh, I have plus 26% with, um, with Radiant Destruction up, I guess. 187. And then let me see what how much the abilities have, because I forgot. 36. Okay, so Lightning Prison optimally is 36% hit rate. I see a lot of I see a lot of kill feed coming from the desert. Why do I see so much kill feed in the desert? Because people are grind are hardcore grinding uh Pila Kujail. Should we go investigate? 
why Pilo 2 Jail? And That's why because it commonly, seems to be commonly accepted as the best um, grind spot for seasonal. Let's go investigate okay. the desert then. How? Yes, uh, I, will, yeah, no. I will go get my horse and head on my way there then. Have fun because... We have, we have no choice but to forcefully slaughter everyone in the desert. What were we about to say, Wally? Oh, right. If there's... I forgot the um, Ator Spear. The knockdown has 9% evasion rate, so... Then you have 26 plus 9 oh, that's you. plus 6. I, I'm a fit. I want to kick you. I'm going to kick you. Come back. Get back here. <laughs> I don't know about that one. Come 41%. Here. All right. No, here. no you fuck. You fuck. You <laughs> 43% hit rate on the final rift storm. Did I, did I miss my TBS? Yep. Are you fucking serious? Hey, you had your I chance. I literally flicked it. You had your chance to kick me. I'm so... I'm literally insane. Oh my god. You find it hard to fight Awakening Warrior as Ninja? Uh... I mean... Awake? Okay, the thing with Awakening Warriors, is they literally just... Okay, wait. I mean, a lot oh. of them just, like, block and then uh, wait for the cooldowns. Flare, I, I just flare grab. No, they don't even grab after flare anymore. They just flare into slashing and hope it one-shots you. Okay, if you're a ninja uh, playing against Warrior, there's really only, like, five skills that you need to keep track of. And then, so those are um, Solar Flare, because that will get you when you're at a distance. So you want to keep track of that and know when they can, and like predict, learn to predict Solar Flares. You want to know their eight second grab. Like, you don't want to know when it's on cooldown, because then you can just get up in their face and they can't grab you if you're in Super Armor or Frontal. You want to know Shield Charge, like when they want to do Shield Charge, because then you can just get behind them and then CC them through Frontal Guard. So that's three skills. Um, probably Ground Smash, because that's AoE Super Armor CC, so that can interfere with things like Shadow Stomp, Block Jump. And then the fifth thing you want to know is just their iframe dash cooldown. Because if they don't have that, then there's nothing they can do to prevent a grab, because they only have one iframe that they commonly use. So like, what I would do is I would probably just wait for them to Solar Flare me, because that's an indication that they use the dash. Or I would just wait for them to like use their Awakening Dash in a way that I can see. And then just grab them within the next two seconds. But see, I just rotate iframe around them and then grab them when they block. And block jump them when they uh, use an attack. <sighs> see, that's why that, that's why when it comes to my guide, you know, I don't want when to is, have to um, put in like cooldowns for every class to watch out for. Wayne is the eminently, the most eminently practical player. Pragmatic. I mean, this has been the case for like years now. He like, doesn't like, really go for the fancy stuff. He, no, he doesn't. He doesn't codify things. Like, remember when we like remember when he kept wrecking me in Sin Mirror, and uh, he didn't know why, and then Bates didn't know why either when I asked him, and then it took like me like six months to discover charm writing, like what he was doing with charm writing, and Wayne well, was never able to explain it to me when I asked him. I that's because I just felt intuitively obvious to me, you know. Wait, I'm gonna post something. Well, in, things, um... things that feel intuitively obvious to you are very different than what most people. Well, when it's intuitive, it's hard to explain it. Because that's so that's the Termian whole point of intuition. is coming back, by the way. But, but yeah, I mean, I, I I think you can summarize that. You can grab a warrior when they're blocking, but I would at least count and make sure that they don't have Jash on cooldown. Otherwise, they're just gonna iframe and balance strike you or something. Um, and then if you want to go block jump them, that's also fine because they can't really punish block jump unless they have the ground smash. And then if you just want to like destroy them every time, you can just count their main cooldowns. Like mm. one of the ones on this game become extremely clear once you learn what a class can do and what threatens, like what your kill condition is, what their kill condition is, and how those two mesh. This man out here asking about kill conditions. I had someone in the range to Discord ask me if PvP add-ons worked for Bloody Monastery because they're humans. Hmm. Well, do they? That is no. a good question. They're moss. 
human damage no, works. No, no, but yeah, there's human damage, but isn't PvP? I, I thought that was the new rumor that like PvP damage is also human damage when it's on skill add-ons. Isn't that the, like the new theory? You'd have to get some serious data mine to convince me of that. Well, since all players are human, and all the humans no, are players. I, don't think, I think most people, most players on this game barely qual have barely evolved past the vertebrate stage. And I have to give them the benefit of the doubt that they're vertebrates because the input method requires you to have an endoskeleton. Nice. Uh-huh. But, but see, the thing is, is that you can test that pretty easily, I think. So what you do is you take someone with, like, uh, 10 human damage in crystals, and then you compare that to someone dealing the same amount, but 10 PvP attack damage. I have the math somewhere here. And then you just compare whether they have the uh, same magnitude of increase. Of, of human damage. Was it big and Chinese? Uh, no, it was mine. Oh, it's yours. Even better. Let's see. By the way, I'm not really seeing the uh, kill message in the desert right now. How close are you to the desert? Uh, I'm at Duvin. I'm like halfway the, to Duvin. Really. Right now, the difference is like 1.1% from my trials. What'd you get as a P value? There's, there, it's not sig. Whatever it is, it's not significant. I forgot all my statistics, so I, I can just link you the sheet and you can do it, but it's nowhere near significant. Imagine doing math. Medical students literally only calculate, um, like, false positive rate, and that's it. Okay, the only thing I have to calculate these days is how well, many months a contract has been and when do I need to ask someone to renew it. Wait, what, Wayne? I mean, that's exactly what you need to calculate the p-value, so... There you go. Perfect yeah. for the job. I guess I guess uh, it's it's time to quit medical school. Just become a statistician instead. Here, Neil, I'm linking you stuff in voice chat text fam. All right, I will take a look at. That's right. Where am I? I don't know what the fuck. My eyes are kind of tired. He's Wait, weird. who's this guy? Oh fuck! He, he he went too far away. I thought he was flagged, but. I'm gonna get some... Okay, I see that now. Drastically punished evil explorer elements their armor. Hey Google, So you really think they're at Pilaku? Sure, changing hallway to tools. Was it Pilaku you said, Wally? Where people are going? I thought it was I Sulfur believe... Mine. It's either Pilaku or Sulfur Mine. Okay, but, but see, they're on completely opposite sides of the map. So maybe it's well, important to know. that's where you get the um, black donkey. Uh, what's it called? Not the black donkey. Yes, uh, the black camel. Is it really that much faster? It's so fast that people said that... Um, what's it called? People said that unicorns were already obsolete due to Okay. But camel. what if I don't have skills on it? What do you think then? Hello? Okay then. It is probably not as good then. Faster than walking or faster than running still or no? Not f fast. I'm pretty sure it's faster than walking. But still, I think it's still pretty important to know whether it's Pilaku. Or so ask him, I'll DM him and ask where's the fight. I guess, and see if he that just tells you. That would be too suspicious. OMG, he said the thing. Sus, 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 amogus. I mean, I'm, I'm trying to like, not make them leave before I get there. I need to cover your face. I knew you were going to say that. <laughs> oh, I thought you were AFK. He came back in time to make a face joke. Oh my god. There's no need to make face jokes. His face is the joke. Oh my god. Don't need to, uh... Don't need to fix what's not broken. <laughs> so I'm at the... Uh, I'm close to the desert now. I'm at rock post. 
By the way, we're gonna have, have to 20. Soon. We will soon have 20 uh, cooldown slots. I mean, that's a good quality of life change, but... It's a very good quality When When are we getting uh, PvP content, though? You know, that's the real question. We convince the fuckers on this game that PvP is actually fun, and... Yeah, never. Oh, well, see, new players always ask how to PvP, and then they get turned away when they say that it takes forever to PvP. That's seasonal because... thing. That's because yeah, of it really the... should be seasonal. It's because of people like me who tell them, okay, you can't PvP until it's just your 700 GS and have... But why would you tell them that I mean, in the first place? I mean, it, it is true, though. It is true. So I should I see that's another thing I should make a video of like shaded. teaching teaching new players about uh seasonal PvP. I but I I have I have so much things in the backlog. I feel like you should make a PvP guide for new players. Like not not even just for ninja, but just like how to PvP on the game in general without knowing anything. But don't you like, have that for um your Fucking uh, book of book combat. Of combat? Yeah. I actually do not. I only I only work up to uh, non like I I I go I do I have uh, quantified stats and like mechanics, but I never go into theory. Mm -hmm. I, I stay away from theory completely in the book of combat. I was gonna put theory in the book of skills, but I never got around to making that before I quit. Oh, what oh wow! Do? The camel is fast. What the fuck? When did they buff it? It's always been pretty fast. All right, do you think they might be a Nagas? Or no? I just ran off the side of a cliff. I'm kind of pissed. Actually, no, this is way fast. It has not been this fast. I remember. Uh, Yeah, I remember. Like, literally, you can run faster on Ranger than the Camel back then. They definitely uh, buffed this. You were this. probably using the base Camel, not the black Camel. No, I had the black Which... Camel as well. Oh, okay. Well, then I don't know. I think I think for sure they buffed it. I never got the black camel, unfortunately. I think I have a camel from the uh, journals. I think I named it camel, though. But see, I guess the apex of BDO PvP is just griefing AFK Fishers at Termian Beach. All right, let's uh, let's grief this AFK Fisher right here. Sounds Looks like it's guardian. Yeah, he was fishing in the desert. Why? Guaranteed abundant? Well, see, since Why? no one fish here, there's going to be a lot of fish. It's just how yeah, fishing works in video. Is there water? Is there playing water here? Yes, you can even fish in Oasis. No, but these are fucking Nagas. <laughs> how the fuck is he fishing at Nagas? <laughs> Wait, go find the water. I don't know. It's, it's, it's just, it just looked like he was fishing to me. Okay. Do, do you think they're PKing over here or no? I pressed the, I pressed V by accident. God damn it! Not PKing. He has fishing level buffs. Just kill yeah. him. Holy fuck. I did not realize oh. it was slowed to that extent. Actually, I'm pretty sure the um the skill where they like summon two dolphins that that slows. Yeah, that's the only explanation. The slows, yes. Oh, you could just look at your buff bar. Well, no. Why would I do that? This course, you're just wrecking your face, Wayne. You're completely outplaying you. Because he's just getting damage rated to death by Mariah skills. He's now serpenting someone. Okay, Got the wait. Down smash on flashing light. Since when did Guardian CC when they uh, smash the ground? Bon. God damn it. Searing flame. I don't know why they're not using Shift F Bon. That shit is range arranged. Wayne, you might actually have some um, mileage out of a guide that teaches a new a new player how to PvP effectively on this game. From seasonal to like basic neutrals and CC <clears throat> fishing to comboing. But see, you know how hard that would be to teach that for every, in a way that works for every single class though. When I can't even write a guide that teaches it for my own class. 
Oh wait, this is wait drastically. Wait, that was the guy who was uh, showing up in the chat, right? What was it him? In the chat in the PK chat. What PK chat? You said there was people PKing on uh, on desert, right? It was him, right? Yes. Yeah. I think so. So they must be at Nagas then, rather than at uh, Pila Two. You have found the BK, and it's uh, closer than we expected, so that's good. But now they all leave. Oh, fuck. I, I, I ran into a rock. I'm, uh, I meant to dash behind him, but I ran into a rock. It's really annoying when I'm trying to do the F cancel forwards, and I just keep, keep kicking because my mouse has let go. Honestly, I'm not going to speed my way there, Lewin. I'm just going to watch on your stream. If you don't mind, just because I know you can one VX the wall. So I kind of just rather watch for now. I mean, that's kind of the whole idea, right? You can watch whenever you want. EVP voyeurism. I, I guess you have punished the evil explorer. What do you have to say for yourself? I, I keep missing right my grab. Well, I'm the real evil explorer here, to be fair. Well, no one's. No, you're, you're the Eldritch Horror. Of the <laughs> what? <laughs> the Eldritch the nicest Horror. block jump. Wait. Ah, uh, my combo failed because I was too slow from the Corsair. Is Wayne the main character, the final boss, or the DLC boss? I think he's the Deuter antagonist. What? Uh, what? He's he's the Ron, Harry Potter. We just don't know who Harry Potter is yet. Oh, he's the John to the Baptist. He's he's the he's the spearman. He's the, one to, he's the one to herald the coming of the Messiah. No, no, no. He's he's the spearman to the Swordsmaster's main character. You know. What does that even uh, mean? So in uh, every yes. in in like in a lot of fantasy genre and like storytelling in general, there will be some sort of archetypical archetypal hero. And then they will have like some sort of trusted friend or ally or possibly enemy, frenemy sort of thing going on where they share a lot of the same traits, but they also have differing traits that make them act as a foil to the main so character. So the anti-hero? No, no the, supporting, the main not supporting character. The, I would say, yeah, the main supporting character, but not necessarily it's supporting. Spear. It's, it's, it's more like a foil. They can be supporting, they can be more frenemy than supporting. Um, but they have a lot of the same traits, except for a few ones that make them stand out from the main character and challenge the main character's development in the story. So that would be like Ron Weasley in Harry Potter, for example. And um, yeah, when, when it comes to cliche animation and which I should, uh, if everyone's using swords, if the main character is using like fans, his fingers or leaves or willow branches, then uh, the foil character is using a sword. If the main character is using a sword, he's the foil character is probably using a spear. So like, so like, uh, uh, but I mean, uh, what makes me that character though? Because uh, you you aren't very main character like. What? That doesn't make any sense. You you just it aren't main perfect. character. -like. It, it makes, makes perfect, perfect sense. <laughs> it does it would... not. No no no. One of the reasons that it does not make sense to you. Is it because it makes sense to make the rest of us? That's that's why. That's how it works. No. <laughs> if, it, if, it, if it made sense no. to you, it wouldn't make sense to us because then you'd be the type of person that makes sense. <laughs> Does this make sense? Uh, Wayne has been has always been the consistent character, and when we change, we change in relation to Wayne. He is he provides the contrast. Wayne, Wayne but then that will the make top. me the main character, and you said I'm oh, not no, the, main, the main, character. main character. has to change. The main character develops, that's the thing. The main character develops. See, I, I think you're kind of like Toph in, in your strengths, you know, in Avatar The Last Airbender. What? She, she stays like very powerful and strong the entire time. And like, she's a, essentially a pillar of character stability against what? everyone else's development. And, and you, you're the same way as you were when you were like 15. Making out well thought out arguments, playing for skill, making montages, getting trolled. <laughs> yes, he what? sets the standard. You're the one trolling me. Well, yes, yes. Because <laughs> yes. you're Best saying time. what you're saying right now doesn't make much sense, but sure. Well, if it made sense to you, then you wouldn't be the the spearman. You would be the foil. 
Because that is one of the things. Because because that's one of the things that makes you stand out from the main character. You know. Because it does things don't make sense. That these things don't make sense. Who's weighing? Uh, I'm weighing. We we call oh. each other by our names instead of our character names because we've known each other for almost ten years. That's why. Well, no, you you call me Wally. I mean, well, I call Wally, you Wally is your name though. That's well, literally Wally, your English name. Because Wally is nicer than the normal name. Wally is a pretty decent name. I mean, no, Wally I, Wally I've is been, your name now. I've been telling you, you should like adopt that as as like your English name. We Christian you, Wally. Hence no, where we, you we, should we, be we known. Couldn't, we couldn't christen him Wally because Wallace is not a Christian name. Or yeah, that's what I meant to say, bro. Is that actually not? No, it's oh, not. It's you not, need to be like something like like Peter or Paul or um, Matthew or something like that. Well, what the, I don't know how Christian names work. Like one of the names of the apostles. Okay, it why did my graph fail there? It's already in the Bible, so you have to be copying someone. Which, but at some point, historical names also work, such as Alexander's. Well, in that case, I'm just I'm just gonna call you like Xerxes since he's probably in the Bible somewhere. Yeah, I'm no, he's, I'm he's way, like... uh Neil is the Sork that was with me, and um, Wally is Wally the. Wally is uh... Wally. Of course. <laughs> yeah. He doesn't need Corsair though. Don't worry. He's he's not completely lost. <sighs> Hello. I guess your name is Dwayne now. Congratulations. I guess he's Dwayne. So who's the Kevin Hart to his Dwayne Johnson? Who's the absolute meme character? I guess that has to be Neil. Wait, why does he say it's bullshit? I only have three buffs. I love being stunned by a Rift boss. Why is it so or... right? Because it's the desert. Turn down the beta, or Wait, why, why did this ninja... What the fuck? Okay, so I guess he is trying to fight. He like attacked me and then ran away for some reason, so I wasn't sure what he was doing. I guess he was to solo them now, though. Yes, I can just 2v1 them if you want. Because that seems like... Uh, overkill. Damn, but this is Sage, your worst enemy. Oh well, I guess he gets CC just like that, so. Well, it be like that sometimes. Okay. I think I'll take the last two days of the week off. That sounds like a good plan. Why can I not move past this random thing in the road? Okay, I hope this guy doesn't mind that I just walk into his rotation and do my Rift Boss. What? Yeah, see, this this guy is Neo here, but it looks like, uh... Oh, it looks like this ninja isn't geared. They are. What if they just go for the grass here? How will he handle this precarious, precarious situation? Need stamina. I'm gonna do a quick stamp rotation. He's dead. Okay. Well, I guess this sort of, this sage is just getting repeatedly cc'd. There's a bond katana. There's a block drop. And it looks like the corsair has given up. Oh look, we're playing the song in my video, Afterglow. Afterglow. Da, 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 da. That's not the song in Afterglow. Oh, is it not? No, it's not. <laughs> Fuck! 
<laughs> the song is "While We Remain" by Ian Bluestone. Could use Cork Baton here. Oh. I I have to wait for him to use Cork Baton. There it is. All right. Now, now I can just go for free CCs, except he's not. I guess we're also swatching you when we win the ninja now. But what happens if I just car on top of him? How many people are doing RBF? Only like 11 now. What are the chances he just dies, I guess? Very high. Damn, he just gets SA traded. Damn. I really hope I didn't map to town without picking up my loot from my rift. I did not. I guess he just uses Lightning Storm in front of me for no reason. And then after Spear for no reason. Just gonna SA trade and then, fuck it. Damn, he just gets SA trade. Damn. Wait, but if he uses a Taurus Spear, that's that's unprotected. I know. It was, uh, too... I didn't expect him to use it. Because there was, like, literal reason, no reason for him to use it. Yeah, except dumb, I guess. This guy says uh -huh. finally. Oh, I guess, uh, I guess that guy got killed by the ninja earlier. <laughs> but now you kill him. All right. We'll see. We didn't wow. really save him. It's more like under new management. Wow, I can't even BG properly now because my mouse just starts randomly letting go. <laughs> oh my god. Bro, Was this... he trash talking that much? I mean, I guess, uh. There's a salty. But I feel like most of them aren't really geared. They yeah, one, one, 190 DP, the ninja says. I think as soon as they're geared, they just stop playing their seasonals. Well, then that kind of defeats the purpose of seasonals. This is, this is definitely under new management. Because I would have done the exact same thing that he was doing. Yeah, they're both just trash talking each other. Or I think, I feel like this guy might actually be trash talking the ninja only. I don't think the ninja's I, talking. No, no, no. Just, because the thing is, is, he's saying, lol, this ninja kept on attacking people that are farming mobs. <laughs> and then I would have literally done the same thing. <laughs> exactly. Give me Bond Katana Shower? Nope. Goes for a good blade spin instead. We're gonna risk it. Just gonna trade here. And yeah, we only have like 11 in RBF now. So I think, um, I think we're probably approaching the end of the stream, yeah. Because uh, PvP for today is probably over. I mean, we have these people, but they're not really geared. Um, we have about like only uh, 10 people left in RBF. So I think for today, we'll probably the end of the stream. Wait, wait, wait. wait. What? Watch this. What? Watch this. Okay, he, he's e -buff. I'm e -buffed and z -buffed. Yo, yo, come here. Enjoy the Karshans. Come die to Karshans. Oh my god, he's going to die to Karshans. Damn it! There we go. What the fuck? He's just one-shot him. Yeah, I'm e buffed and z buffed, and he was already at 40% HP, so I just imminent doomed him. Bruh. Rotate super armor and I need to frames. Get this, uh, I'm ninja. rotating super armor and I frames. I'm rotating super armors and I frames. I'm <laughs> rotating Are you okay? super Bruh, armors. You just got, and you're frames. just getting wrecked now. It's Damn, okay, he just outplayed you. Cause I got iframe, iframe, iframe. Um, He's just outplayed. I'm iframe. I'm iframe, my skill. I need to give this ninja a perfume of courage and uh, draft to make it more fair. I'm um, iframe. I'm violationing. Fuck. Oh, it's come yeah, CC'd again. No, no, no. I'm just gonna violation him. Uh, fuck it. There we go. Damn. <laughs> Here, I guess.
Maybe we need to uh, make the fight more fair. What is this betrayal? We had to make the fight more fair. All right, we we had to make the fight more fair. What is this? <laughs> see, see, he CC'd you, so so it was fair. I I, I think it I think it was fair. I guess we know who the main character is. It's me. <laughs> what do you mean? Because I I because I get betrayed. I guess. All right, all right, guys. So, um, so I think I'm going to be ending the stream now. Had a uh, had some piece, had a bit of PvP, did a bit of RBF, but uh, but yeah. So thanks everyone for watching and uh, have a good night. Yeah. All right, night, cheers, everyone. cheers, everyone. Take care.